All right, welcome back to Heroes in Training. We are in the middle of a tournament. Um, I'm going to do uh, hopefully something really funny if I can pull it off right. Um, I, I think uh, we, we're going to get like um, a little bit of a recap with um, uh, uh, like coming back from a commercial break, um, which totally doesn't make sense in, in narratives because... We're in the middle uh, of the fight. Yeah, it, there, there isn't actually a break in between and what's going on here. Uh, but um, we get like uh, we get like the shot of like a um, uh, like there's some like cool like NFL style music, right? Where it's like uh, <laughs> welcome back, yeah, <laughs> yeah, and it's like the heroes in training tournaments. Um, and uh, if I can focus ping. Here, <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me focus ping you guys to over here. Um, these are these are the uh, so like there's like up up here there's like a teachers lounge area, um, where they can like uh, see everything that's going on. Kind of like a what's the word like um a box like seat a or whatever a box seat. Yeah, a box seat. Um, so all these teachers uh, over here are like kind of hanging out. And then these four are like up in like uh, uh, chairs with like headsets on and they're like announcing for the mm -hmm. uh, tournament. And I'm going to kind of cycle through these characters as we go. But you can uh, just see my for... shame of the tokens that I didn't have a chance to create for Connor. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's yeah, actually so... really convenient. Now I know which ones are new. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this is this is mnemonic. And this is architect. Um. It doesn't look like he did a good job. It's on fire in the background. <laughs> yeah, it's, I figured it was like nine eleven just happened in the background. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I had to. I had to decide between. Um, uh it's. I can't really explain it now because it's a long story. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, I, it was good. I, I, just I, had, I had a hard time deciding what image to use based off of that. I was Narrative like, stuff. literally, I thought the same thing. I was like, maybe well, architect, that's why he's does there. Does he look he's like a good architect? <laughs> fix the natural disaster that happened. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, um, and then obviously duplicity and angel there are, are, are there as well. And, uh, so we, we get like, uh, coming back from a commercial break and, and, uh, they're like, welcome back to the heroes and training tournament. This is duplicity. Um, so far, uh, very few people have scored. Palladium has one rescued civilian, uh, Bastion and Thunder both just got some, uh, uh what's, what's the word? Destruction. Uh, some some combat class or no some combat points by taking out some medium sized um, enemies, but immediately lost their points when they destroyed buildings unnecessarily. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> rude. Uh, uh, and then I'm going to get a little bit of uh, um, everyone else is is uh, in pursuit of uh, rescuing certain civilians, and I think um, uh, yep. mnemonic uh, here takes over and. Uh, um, she says, um, it looks like everybody has been, uh, teaming up with their, uh, normal class teams, uh, alchemist and bioelastic are leading their teams to rescue civilians in droves. Looks like they'll be on their way back soon to score multiple points. Class one, a is being led by, I mean, our class, I mean, team <laughs> one, <laughs> um, uh, I think uh, uh, Angel says, it looks like Left Wing is uh, covered in ice statues. Oh, no. What will he do? <laughs> and uh, uh, then I think, uh, what's his name? Another teacher Architects. says, uh, probably teleport. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I think Arch Architect says that. Um, can't he just like teleport or something? <laughs> uh, and then Mnemonic says, um, Looks like Bubble Boy is caught in a sticky situation here. Looks like Bastion and Thunder might be uh, taking him out. But oh no, look, statue has gotten in the way. What will happen next? And uh, we... Uh, Good question. <laughs> yeah, pop it. Oh, da, 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 da. Yeah. <laughs> that, was, uh, that was the purpose of that, uh, um, that song I sent you guys, Into the Fire. That's like the... Uh, um, coming oh. back from the commercial break. I wish I would have listened we, to it now. <laughs> before we come back from the commercial break, maybe the commercial break people want to announce the stakes that are at stake here. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, thank you. That's You're the welcome. real reason. Yeah, I, that was yeah, the whole yeah. reason you wanted to do this. I know. This. I was the whole reason I wanted to do this. Yeah. Um, yeah, so uh, uh, I think uh, um, Architect is the one that says it. Um, 
just for our listeners tuning in for the first time, uh, the, the stakes of this tournament are as follows. The top 10 finishers all get one star. Now, these stars are to help them move along in the, uh, uh, what's the word? Rankings? Uh, like the, yeah, the rankings. Uh, the rankings. If they get enough stars, they'll be promoted. The top five contestants will all get two stars. The third place will get three. Second place gets five. And the first place winner gets 10 stars, which is essentially Bro. an automatic promotion. Yeah, that's sick. So all of these contestants are fighting to try and win the tournament so that they can prove themselves not only to the nation, but to their own uh, teachers and classes and so the, uh, to the, hip the end of the itself. tournament. Winning the tournament gives you 10 stars. Yes. yes okay. Winning the tournament. I thought you, I thought you were, for a second, I thought you were saying winning this round of the tournament. No, the 10 stars. no I was like, uh, not, Connor, no. wow, you are really so, fast tracking this. Yeah. So, so the, I, the point, it's not points, right? It's about who wins the 1v1s and stuff. Uh, How do you decide yes. who wins? Sorry. Okay. Yeah. So, so uh, I think we'll, we'll get a little bit more okay. of that. I just, actually. I was like, if I'll, I'll remind you, yeah. If it's about points, then uh, I'm going to abandon this, this plan and start. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> uh, Mnemonic <laughs> comes back in and says, um, uh, the, the four, the top four scorers of this round will, will all receive an advantage in the second phase. Each each phase provides an advantage in the next phase, with the final phase deciding the winners. Only uh, 18 contestants will make it to phase four. Gotcha. Okay. That, that, that. Uh, okay, so I think I think that's it. So uh, but the, and then they say, so what will happen next? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so so I think. Uh, left wing. I know your plan last time was you were you were encased in ice, right? You yeah. wanted to do like that a, was not my plan. That was your plan. <laughs> no, no. Your your your, your I, plan was to do like a three sixty no scope. I wanted and, to do uh, that, and then I realized it made way more sense to just switch with the bubble guy who hasn't moved. Uh, and I can remember where he is. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. I thought you're okay. That. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. yeah. My original plan was to. Was to switch with um, uh, I thought your initial plan was to switch with Bubble Boy and then switch with Quantum Quill and then switch with uh, uh, Blank. Oh, I guess that was it because then he would fall, or maybe not. He can teleport. Some yeah, maybe someone else besides Blank, but yeah. And the stone guy just fell out of the sky, so he's clearly not going to be too worried about it. (laughs) <laughs> uh, yeah yeah he just yeah so left and you were in the ice statues but maybe we'll get a shot of like you peeking through the ice and seeing statue literally just like jump down uh from yeah. the building and then harden himself and then he just like fell like flat onto the <laughs> onto the concrete in front of bastion and thunder mm-hmm. and then just like so hardens and stands it, up I have, I have a quick question just for clarification yeah. so i can remember who these yeah. sidekicks are uh s- s- the statue is not the guy who makes statues no the guy no, correct yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, so this is statue yeah he har- and he's he, just he a statue yeah, yeah 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 this is i shouldn't shouldn't have put him on the same team just realizing so did, it did, now. Did, did this is steal, blank steal the other guy's name <laughs> uh, no no because <laughs> that would have been hilarious name, that, yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah i didn't i didn't think that through but that would have been funny um, yeah, so so uh, uh, Blink's power leaves behind ice statues of himself, but his yeah. his power is that he can teleport. teleport so right. That's why his name is Blink. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, I shouldn't have put them on the same team because it's a little bit confusing. But uh, this is Laser Pointer. He's pretty obvious. Um, this is Null. Um, so Blink, Laser Pointer, and Null are all on top of the building with um, Left Wing. And then I, w- I wonder if Null nullifies anything. That statue down by Bastion and, and Thunder and. Uh, that's Bubble Boy, and Bubble Girl yeah, is dead. I mean, so she yeah. got teleported. Uh, Bubble Gum, Bubble Gum. Oh, Bubble yeah. Gum. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Man, that would have like, been so bubble easy, bubble Connor. Could have just Ayo. Bubble, bubble Gum. Uh, actually, uh, that is part of her character. She pretends to be dumb. Nice. Bit of an so airhead, bubble, you might bubble say. Bubble Gum, Bubble Gum. Yeah, yeah, an airhead. Yeah, yeah. So there's lots of puns and jokes in here. Uh, but okay, so who wants to do something oh, first? Left wing. Notes. Did you want to? 
<laughs> Did you want to try and uh, swap places with Bubble Boy as your first action? Yeah, I think so, yeah. And this is my second action. I'm going to take a shot. No, okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> so um, you're, you're, uh, in order to do that, you'd have to give him his power back. Just a heads up. Uh, right. Yeah, I'm not really worried about him being able to bubble once he's in here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Love when you got to take a slow turn so you get three actions. Uh, yeah. Pop the bubble. <laughs> yes. I just did. Yeah, um, yeah. Just the other bubble. All right. Uh, here we go. Bubble. What, am, what am I doing? <laughs> right. Freak. Okay. Oh, I should have had a plus one. Okay. There it doesn't matter. So he's teleporting. Dang. He's, he's, I'm uh, switching places with bubble. bubble. So he's encased yep. in uh, stuff. Yeah. I would have given you a minus one for that since that's something that's. Oh, then this is what I actually wrote because I get it, a plus it, one yeah. against this group. Yeah. And, the, but it literally doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, so okay, I guess yeah, so, so you swap places with Bubble Boy. Let me switch your. Well, I was like running past there. him, or, or yeah, sorry, so he, he like, was no, he, he was running cool. past me rather. Yeah, yeah, he was saluting you, and then he he becomes in case of ice, and he's like, "Oh, come on!" <laughs> yes, I'm like, "Oh, hey, left wing." Uh, so, that that works. Yep, that's two down. I mean, I don't know how long the statues will last. Maybe you should just go up there and punch him. That's not my job. It's yours, and I. <laughs> <laughs> Is your goal to just run back in to try and get more uh, probably um, duplicities? All right, so I moved you a little bit. So then, uh, Mist probably I don't know. Mist is Mist has probably had all three of these, uh, and is like water carrying them, like water wave carrying them, like yeah, pushing them onward. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's a water bed. Um, yeah, yeah. But <laughs> literally, yeah, that's literally how she's doing it. So she's probably coming around with uh, the corner with these three. Uh, and then Bastian, are you able to? Um, uh, resolve yeah. what your situation with statue. Okay. Yeah, you can't hear Miss Rachel in the background, right? Uh, no, I can't. can't no. Okay. Good. Um. So what? What was the last thing that you like? What, so, you so stat- what am I yeah, statue. Statue. Statue says you stole my hero name. Oh. Oops. I, yeah, I didn't even know what it meant when I got here. It just sounded cool. <laughs> It's like that makes it so much worse. Um, what, they, what, I think what I think we the... get like an anime moment where he like he like gives you a sob story, and we get like the like bubble above his head, and he's like, <laughs> um, he's like, uh, I spent hours thinking of the coolest hero name I came up with, Bastion, and then and once I submitted it. They sent me a letter back and said it was already taken. And they said I only had one week to come up with another name or they would assign one to me. And I couldn't think of anything better than statue. You took everything from me. I don't yeah. know who you <laughs> are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so good. I love this guy already. He's so fun. Uh, so he says... Uh, uh, that and and uh um i think blink like steps over the edge of the building and he's like he's like yo statue just forget about them we have to go rescue civilians and 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 uh um defeat more of this the constructs look they're bastion and thunder both have zero points anyway and he like points to the scoreboard wait what but we but we but we destroyed robots yeah thunder thunder like looks at you and you look at thunder and thunder goes Oh, the one time I don't hold back with my powers. This was the secret rule. We can't just go destroying stuff willy nilly. Oh, they told us specifically everything we learned in classes. That means property destruction. No. (laughs) Destroying stuff is so fun. (laughs) Uh, So as, as you two are doing that, I think statue looks up at blink and just shakes his head and he's like, no. This is more important than the tournament. Petty revenge. <laughs> and uh, he's going to take a swing at you. What, what is the chemical composition of his body? Uh, that is a great question. So, I, so, I also uh, this. <laughs> like, so what kind of rock is Yeah, because this is either going to be incredibly easy or... I didn't mi- think about that. Or, I mean... Mildly difficult. Mild- <laughs> well, why don't, why don't you roll... Uh, what, whatever you're going to do, I don't know if it's going to be danger or 
or what, and then and we'll kind of decide it from there. I don't think I, I, I'm I'm going to say for certain he's not a hundred percent carbon, or maybe even yeah. something as like fifty percent carbon. But mm-hmm. maybe there's parts of his body that are carbon. But why don't we roll to find out? Because I I didn't really decide or think about that. So mm-hmm. I don't yeah. know if you're going to roll danger. Oh, I, well, you'd probably have to roll. Danger. You made a guy at a rock. You didn't think about whether or not he could be um, rock bended. I'm going to do. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to do kidding. control like <laughs> well, situation. You made like forty characters. Yeah. Good character. I'm not going to like destroy him but i'm gonna use my powers to like shape him in a way or is that, would uh, that be yeah can you like puppeteer him <laughs> well i think that would be danger i think i think that would be well f- first of all he is attacking you um so he is trying to trade blows with you and then yeah. uh i think anything that targets someone specifically uh should be should mm-hmm. be danger i mean i guess go ahead and tell me what you want to do I mean, dangerous uh, for like inflicting conditions, right? That's like trying to take yeah. somebody out. So if he was trying to like right. manipulate him and punch somebody else, I mean, yeah. I, so I, I guess what 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 is it you're specifically trying to to accomplish? I want to turn him into a lampshade. <laughs> <laughs> what? I want to turn him into a lamp. Pretty sure that would kill him. <laughs> he still has organs, right? I don't know. All right, they can, um, they can, just, they can all just be in there. Uh, so, so, so tell me, so tell me what best, so, so statue comes in and he like, um, he, he, so basically, uh, he basically trades like mobility for, um, toughness. So, Mm -hmm. uh, he like hardens his arm as he like comes in, um, to, to like, uh, punch you and his, his arm, his whole arm becomes like super rigid. Mm -hmm. Oh, the rest um, of his body isn't hard anymore. It just hardens when he wants it to. Uh, so it's like he it's controls like the, the hardness for it. So yeah, it's like tightness. Mm-hmm. So um, the the more he pushes into, yeah, I'm sure you do. Uh, <laughs> the more he uh like uh becomes statue, the less control he has to like mm-hmm. move. So uh, so is is he like Colossus where he's like always? No, like, so he so okay. he can he can fully unform and just be a normal person. Uh, I don't know who Colossus is, but. Um, I also don't know if Colossus can unform. Colossus is the so is so a, when he um, fell, he you, was like just a completely okay. immobile statue, and then he just like unhardened himself okay. and like stood up. He probably still was somewhat hardened, so he yeah. kind of looks like his picture there. So um, is this a, is this hardening like because you remember here in academia, there's two hardening characters: there's a guy who can turn to yeah. metal, and there's a guy who can just makes his skin hard. Is this <laughs> yeah. is this that, or is it like he's turning to rock? He's turning to rock. Okay, okay, okay. and but but the the the. Uh, makeup of this rock is extremely durable, like impossibly right. durable. Sure. I'm going to use my uh, I'm just going to dive directly in without regard for my own safety. <laughs> yeah, okay. Just punch his hand injury, with your hand. And I'm just going to rip all the rock from his flesh. I think the he gets uh, turned to rock, so I think that would include tearing off his flesh. Yeah, well, so they said they said they were going to save him. I'm not going to kill him. Yeah, yeah. So your goal <laughs> is to just true, like I what uh, pull his body apart. Well, you you said he does he turn rock all the way through? I think it was just his arm, right? You said his just his uh, arm is turning to rock right now when he's turning. No, so like so like he he has a a, a coat of hardening. Over his body. So, okay, let me pull up the oh, picture. Okay. So he looks like this, right? He has a I'm coat just, of I'm just ripping his flesh up. Um, and he he adds, like, a bunch of hardening to his his arm. So so you're trying okay. to... So you, like, give me, give, me a, give me a direct, like... So you, you're trying to, like, pull the carbon apart in his chest, or, like... It's like peeling off of him, so he's just, like, a, a normal flesh boy. Okay, okay. So just peeling the rock off of his... <laughs> that would... That's... Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. He I instantly dies. No. I'm gonna. I mean, we'll find out if it I would know. kill him. He'll be teleported. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we, will, we will find out. Oof, that's not good. Uh, okay, so you're rolling savior instead of danger for the uh, uh, yeah. danger move, right? So that's uh-huh. uh, sorry, I forget what it's called. Directly engage a threat. So. Uh, on a seven to nine, you trade blows, right? But you pick one. You either resist or avoid their blows, take something from them, create an opportunity for your allies, or impress, surprise, or frighten the opposition. Can I use team here to I mean, help him? It would just be an eight. So he, he has a seven. So in, if oh, you wanted right, to yeah, use team. Oh, that's a, another good point, actually. We have to be aware of the team. So last time, 
uh, three team. Okay, I, I left a note. So there is three team in the pool. I'm oh, not really? going to add yeah. team since there hasn't been like a time uh, shift at yeah. all. I think you only um, add team and then at the beginning of. Right? I I believe I can't remember exactly what yeah. we decided, but this doesn't matter. Um, for each phase, I'll add two team. Um, oh, okay. And and I think if if your guys are in a phase or you guys are in different teams, you might just get separate pools. So we'll we'll decide that later. But currently, sure. there is three team. Okay. I think I'll do avoid damage. Because I mean, we gotta make it through this and the next competition. And he still yep. takes damage, right? Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah. So, so I think he just um, can't get to me. Is how I like the process of like peeling his. You're just like force doesn't allow him, him to get closer. Yeah. 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 So I think I think if you try to um like peel off the the rock from him, you find that it's like um uh, what's the word? Like it's too much too much grafted to his his body so if like i if off. i just like but i think were you, to do it he would die so he just kind of like freezes in place right um no i think i think or, more like uh well, i think what would be interesting since you are inflicting a condition on him quote unquote okay. um i think he goes in for a punch but he's really heavy and you try mm-hmm. to like pull it and and it doesn't come loose and so instead you just like uh push him as a whole with his arm and he just like falls <laughs> into the building just yank his arm if, if that's okay with you he he, bro- like he broke that build. That was him. <laughs> that was him. Yeah. Broke the building. Yeah. <laughs> um, does, he, does he go down to negative one? Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't know exactly how that would. I, think I mean, he, let's, you know, let's think I think you both like get this. negative one. <laughs> what? As I say, yeah, if a I telekinetic think... person picks someone up and throws them through a wall, it's not that person's fault. They fall through a wall. Well, but I so I think why would I, think I get the way that the judges see? Okay, let's get a shot unnecessarily. I was protecting myself. He was the aggressor. <laughs> <laughs> well, so so um, in terms of like the, the so like the class that this is based off of, right, mm-hmm. is like the economics and morality class, right. which is if there is an if if it's unavoidable, right, then it makes yeah. sense. This is a circumstance where you two are fighting each other, which they explicitly said this is a bad strategy. Don't do this. Uh-huh. Um. And so when you guys are fighting and the result of it is damage, I think we get a shot of like the judges or like the teachers up and they kind of look at each other and they like press up, they like together, two of them press <laughs> the button at time. the same time. Even, even if I wasn't the one who wanted to fight. What's that? Even if I wasn't the one who wanted to fight, he kind of just attacked. Yeah, he didn't yeah, pick I the think fight so. to be fair. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think so. I think the, I think their idea here is they're like, uh, they're fighting each other and that's that's their call for it. I just yell at the sky like, "What? You want me to let him kill me?" <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think I think we get a shot of uh, maybe you can like see them up on the uh, in the um, what's it called the we just it's said the this box. the box yeah the, the box sky thing box. yeah you <laughs> can just see them like through the one. glass and and you yell yeah <laughs> you yell <at> them from <laughs> there and yeah they they like turn to each other and and one of them shrugs and, <laughs> and they just like they just keep going on and then, then I get <laughs> half I get half a point back <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh man! Uh, I mean, uh, all right. Oh, I just, I, I just shrugged the thunder. I'm like, let's, thunder, go, yeah. let's go smash more stuff. <laughs> yeah. um, it, am I uh, near, so nearby I think, when this is happening? Uh, yeah, you're, you're right here. Well, you said you were going to go in to um the the building to try and get more. Uh, Ma- mainly, clones, I'm wondering. I see this as you're going by. Was I there when Thunder lamented to the sky about property damage? Yeah, I think she was talking to you. Well, she no, she was talking to Bastion. But okay, if I was nearby, oh, I would have sorry. like yeah. I would have apologized myself. I would have been like, ah, I'm so sorry, guys. I should have thought of that. That's my my bad. Sure, yeah. And I think as you're saying that, Mist comes behind you with like these duplicity clones, and it's like, oh, well, I should have done it in this group. Um, and she's like, "Come on, guys, get a move on. <laughs> what are you standing around for?" All right, change of plans, Bastion. Um. Uh, Bastion Thunder, let's try to uh, focus on on saving civilians. Um, left wing, we need some interference over here. Statue is causing some problems. I think we got to Statue, and he's stuck in the building. <laughs> he like fell into it and hardened his skin, and and uh, he's like trying to like unharden, but not unharden so much that like the building that's him. like on him, yeah, it's like gonna hurt him. He's like he's like. Can oh, I- 
Okay. No. Can I, can I so so I, I would have said that when he was still fighting Bastion, but <laughs> yeah. yeah yes, and yeah. Then ba- yes, then Bastion just like force pushes him basically into the building. And he's mm-hmm. like, oh. okay. can I try and steal his power? As I think it's a, it's a probably a whole body power, but can I try and steal it? Yeah, I think you see. I think you see it, it, that it's like uh, mist and. Uh, um, mm-hmm. I I want to dampen it as much as possible so that the building will crush. <laughs> uh, yeah. Or at least I want to try that. Yeah. I'm trying to think. Based. Um. <laughs> uh, I think try it at a minus two. I think. Yeah, I think the situation good. that he's in. I think like if you're trying to. Well, I don't know. Basically, like I want to. I mean, my idea is that if I can steal as much of it as possible. Like, I, it's okay. He, the he's worried that the building is going to collapse. Can I tell that the building might collapse on him? Uh, so, so the building isn't going to collapse, but like the pieces that are on him, he's trying. He's just struggling to get out. Careful enough that he's not going to hurt himself as he's coming out. I'm trying to decide okay. if you're able to take enough of his power that then that will certainly hurt him. So I think that's why I minus two. Sure. So if you, right. if that's you, fine. okay, yeah, I'm. Yeah. Um, I have a plus one against this team, though, right? So, so minus one. Uh, yes, yes, you do. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. So minus one. Oh, oh no. Oh, okay, so our first miss, but you can use team if you want to. Um, I help him. <laughs> thunder, thunder could go over and, <laughs> and disintegrate him. <laughs> Well, well no, huh? so okay. The, the, well, points don't, him, but like, the points don't carry over, right? They don't. No. All right. So I'm like, hey, Bastion, you're already negative. Just pull the rocks down. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try and make him softer. Squish him. I, I, I mean, I guess I already did break that building. What's a little more breaking of the same building? Yeah, they can't. They, uh, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, double jeopardy. They can't. They can't charge you for the same thing twice. <laughs> <laughs> That would be really funny. I do it, but can I can I roll to try and do it stealthily so that they think it's Stone Guy struggling? Uh, I I so because you're using team, I'm just going to say that you you do it stealthily. Yeah, oh, I'm going to yeah, say that oh. you just do it stealthily because I, I don't. Part of me like, wants to just fail and then like and oh then, oh no <laughs> statue, <laughs> you're struggling is breaking the building even so more. Is, yeah. is um so he's well, trying to steal his power of stealthy, but that's what left wing is doing right now he's stealing yeah his powers. dampening his power as much as possible because yeah. it's a well, full body is, power what does a seven and nine do that because there's 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 a still oh, that's a consequence, right yeah, yeah right yeah. so that's probably um, what bastion so it's help you know it's, it's unstable it's, or temporary or you mark a condition oh okay so on the um, seven to nine market condition or the gm will tell you how the effect is unstable or temporary i mean unstable well, temporary is fine because he's i'm hoping he'll die but that doesn't feel like much of a you know what i mean yeah yeah I think that's kind of already true. I feel like unstable and temporary would probably have to focus on the unstable part instead of the temporary part. If if you are able to get him out of the match using this move, right? So it would have to be like... Unstable could be like you destroy the building. And right, the, the building, building comes down. Destroys more buildings. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's fine because he's... Where, where is he in the building? Right here? Uh, yeah, that that's him. That's him right there. I mean, only his teammates are above him, so I'm fool, I'm cool with that. This this destroyed the. And to be fair, I did ask Bastion literally to pull the the rocks down on him, so it would probably do that anyways. It's like more collateral damage than they mean to. Yeah, so maybe you know I, I might lose some points there. I'm, I'm fine with that. I mean, I don't know that they can tell that I'm doing anything, but up to you, Connor. Um. So like what, okay, let, let, let me put it this way. So if if you if you're saying you want the uh, if you're okay, so you either mark a condition or the GM will tell you how the effect is unstable or temporary. Oh, so sure, that's yeah. the control that you get over it. So if you want to say, I want the GM to decide if it's the, how the effect is unstable or temporary. Yeah, I think I'll our suggestion was just that my, because it my can't really be temporary. Right. Well, I'm just saying my answer isn't that the building collapses. And okay. takes all of his teammates with him. <laughs> that's not. Well, sure. That's not yeah, the that's unstable fair. condition. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's, that's the fair. only thing. I'll well, say. I, guess I think the idea what, was what that left wing will lose points or something, be. right? Left wing will not lose points. Yeah, I don't think there's any way to know that I'm doing anything. Yeah, there's yeah, there's no way for them to prove it or to tell, and and they have a lot of other people to see. Mm-hmm. And yeah. Bastion's also helping, and I'm just saying it. They're doing it stealthily enough, and they're just. Gonna yeah, I mean, what what would be the? I don't really want to take a condition. So, what would be the unstable thing if I pick that? Um, that's what I'm trying to decide. Uh, 
Yeah, because that's the thing. I don't know that there's a lot of stuff that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> because I, I, I think the idea that we were positing originally is that there's collateral damage that looks bad or, or that causes problems for our team. You know, whatever that could look like. Uh, let's say... No, that's lame. Um, or it could just be I'm temporary just, and now he's more angry. <laughs> I'm just okay, taking right. uh, Well, I, I was going to say maybe... Uh, um, Maybe this building becomes impassable and you can't get back into this building to see if there's more uh, civilians or. or yeah, OK, that makes it was sense. empty, didn't you? Uh, I think I think Bastion posited last time that it was empty, but you guys technically didn't look through all these rooms back here. You just kind of. Yeah, I, I like the idea that like me and um, or probably just me, uh, Mist is taking her civilians all the way over to the triage. But like yeah. I head back over to the back. En- entrance or whatever right like i'm look i'm trying to go towards yeah. that area and then the whole building just yeah like, the, like the yeah, guys yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. that's fine and uh <laughs> yeah then we see we see statues number go down to like negative 15 <laughs> <laughs> right uh, he, like I, killed a bunch of civilians so funny uh and i think he he looks hurt but he doesn't disappear hmm. okay because he's he's he tough boy uh, yeah, so then is, I'm going to say uh, it's not laser easy to coordinate I mean, without comms. What's that? This is not as easy to coordinate without comms because oh, yeah. I would have just been oh, like, OK, sure. left yeah. wing, you know, do this thing. But yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so, so, so you know, I was talking to him. He's still, he's still OK. Yeah, he's not. Well, he's not OK, but he's he doesn't disappear. Oh, oh, he's not, he didn't gotcha. die. Right. Um, <laughs> right. OK. Uh, so so laser, or literally. Yeah. Laser pointer uh, gets blank out. He's like. Or not blank, bubble boy. He's like, he's like, bubble boy, duck, and and does like a zoom over the ice statues. How many and, buildings uh, does he Noel tear in half off. when he does that? Uh, How many buildings zero. does he just rip straight zero. through? He he he, he angles them? it. That's well, okay. it's not a it's not a laser that goes on infinitely. Um, so it's not a laser. That's the definition well, of a laser. But yeah. <laughs> uh, you could have it be no where like the, the laser. If it's intense enough to cut something. Then it, it's functionally going to go as far as it matters. Let me. Okay, I got to decide yeah, how that you, works then. Because yeah, you, we do have to decide he could just works. kill people in the audience. It's a, it's a superpower. Right. I, he can control it. It's. Well, yeah, yeah. Say he but what can I, control I don't need to. But I don't what I, know yeah, how what I mean that is, exactly works. I don't mean that you have to know the science of it. I'm just like you need to decide how it works, right? Yeah, yeah. Right. I think I think. Uh, um, yeah, I think he can control the length of it. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> which, jokes for him which, too. which makes him super dope uh yeah okay. yeah that's pretty cool yeah, yeah he he does like a um like a laser he's, pointer he's thing probably but i think real impressed with, with the ladies okay yeah there's there, yeah, yeah, the joke yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> uh so he he laser pointers off uh bubble boy and gets bubble boy back out and i think um uh uh blink uh teleports down to try and help statue and uh, Bubble Boy, Laser Pointer, and Null are like coming down on a bubble down uh, down here. So you guys can decide what you she want. She came to do down next. on a bubble, bro. <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> Grow up. You're gonna you're gonna stand there and tell me that I'm wrong. <laughs> what is that from? It's from a stupid meme. A Don't video where they're arguing about, about like the Wicked Witch of the West and the Good Witch. Of oh the- yeah, <laughs> I do okay, remember that. Yeah, he came yeah. down in a bubble, bro. <laughs> I still don't so know what stupid. they're arguing about. Like, I, don't, I, know, I don't think anybody. It's very knows, unclear. So that's the point. <laughs> you know, so it's funny. really it was really unclear. Um, OK, so uh, Connor, uh, I'd like to think that, like, whenever the next time someone asks Laser Pointer about, like, maybe in the background after this match, we get someone come up to Laser Pointer and be like, hey, how, did, how does your power work? It's really cool. I saw that you could do, like, control the length of your laser. How is that even possible? And then he, like, starts to explain. He's like, well, actually, the science is really interesting. And then we, like, the, uh, we pass by in front of the camera and yeah. we just follow us and we never get the explanation. I, <laughs> right. I was actually thinking, he says, oh, I can control the length. <laughs> and then moves on. <laughs> it's like, man, I, all those I things didn't know like, that. nothing. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I'm going to say also Quantum Quill is like coming back down from high up in the sky and is like, right. uh, uh, Bladium, what did you say? Are we changing up the plan? And Miss brings over these three to, to yeah. the thing. I, I, I come back over as best I can and I say, we got a problem. Collateral damage is going to lose us a lot of points. Thunder, Bastion, I'm like, okay, everybody, you know, huddle up, <laughs> right? Everybody over here. I'm like, Thunder, Bastion, you guys are going to have to figure out a different strategy. I'm thinking that you can use uh, at least Bastion could, should be able to use his powers to save people pretty well. So we pivoting I've got to that the ultimate idea. <laughs> yes. Oh no. I, I just I need to I need to do burn quick. 
<laughs> I feel a here's, disturbance in the force. <laughs> here's the thing. If you level the entire arena, the amount of stuff you destroy will equal the amount of points you lose. And no one else will be able to score points because everyone will be dead. And then we'll, that, and then, I mean, that's a pretty good idea. Mr. I have Lynn a feeling that none of us have more points than have the most points, which means that. But, but here's the thing. If everyone's at zero and he's at negative 10,000, he's only second place. <laughs> Um, what do I get for nine for doing burn? You can just uh, get two. You just mark conditions, I think, or something. Well, I, 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 I yeah, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> well, is it's it not on in your the... character sheet. Is it on your character sheet? Should be. Yep. On a seven and nine, mark a condition. You hold oh. three burn. Oh, perfect. Okay. Oh, um, yeah. On a hit, you I'm hold gonna... three burn. On a seven and nine, you mark a condition as well. I'm, I'm angry at statue for making yeah. us lose points no okay. right, uh, yes his fault <laughs> i want to unleash my powers to fix every bit of damage that has been done uh i don't think that's something you can actually do and, and I'll, there's there's a there's a, a another reason for this but also not everything here is made of carbon so i don't well, I, i'd replace i'd replace the broken stuff with you know carbon i don't think yeah. there's enough carbon in I think you'd have to destroy other stuff, right? Them, to get yeah. the carbon. <laughs> to get the carbon, yeah. I don't think that seems like a feasible thing you I'd can do. And I don't think you're skilled enough, okay. like in architecture, to like okay. do that. It's a good yeah, idea, I guess though. That makes sense. Yeah. I was confident because I just have an instant 10. <laughs> right, yeah. Yeah, but oh, like sure, yeah. Yeah. instant 10s don't, don't allow you to um, do something that Connor says is impossible. Mm -hmm. right. Right. Well, yeah. and so also, um I, I'm another <laughs> another reason just um will kind of be revealed later uh yeah. these aren't real buildings oh uh so i'm gonna say that's another reason why there's well does bastion try the and then what do you do you want to describe oh, that's what a happens few. when he tries uh sure yeah if, if you want to say well, that he, you try if, to do that i'm just well, he doesn't know that it's of impossible reality right? i don't think Bastion. like I, I don't think that's something bastion is capable of doing is like repairing a building well yeah. do we maybe see then I mean, bastion say it out loud and then one of us is like Bastion, like maybe, you're not going to be able to do that, right? Yeah, I don't know. That's up to you. So yeah, what do you think? I was going to like sense. repair them to like 100 percent what they were before, but like to a point where try and patch up yeah. the damage. Yeah, but if, um, if the, the buildings aren't real, that's fine. I mean, the building is as real as it. It's physical. It, it's just not it's made physical. out of the stuff you expect it, it to be, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it, it, it is kind of. So Connor, it's, there's it's, not a chance that he could uh, with a, with a roll. He could not like, um, in a. I'm trying to think of what I'm trying to say. Uh, He's just trying to get it, points back, right? Right. He, that's he the main thing, right? It's like that he fixes the the thing he did wrong. Not necessarily that he fixes every cr nick and cranny on the building. Um, is that is that just impossible, or is there a possibility with a good roll that he could uh, win the judge's favor back? I think he can win. I, I don't think he's going to replace all of his points, but I think I think he can get uh, uh, maybe like five points or something back from it. If you want to just want to do like an auto succeed, Jared, is that what your plan was? Or or no, you can roll. He'll first. roll you first, can, you right? Can test yeah. It first. I forgot. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think that's fine. I don't, I don't think it's so like you patch it up in a way that's like it's like, hey, look, it's not all <laughs> it's you know, like, destroyed. It's like kind of like yeah. leaning awkwardly, and, and, and it'll, it'll and be much as, easier as long as after Bastion. Bastion as long as yeah. after Bastion does that, he gives a thumbs up to the box. <laughs> exactly right. Yeah. <laughs> well, it makes sense though that like even if it's technically like the yeah. the the way it's structured isn't possible to do this. The the it's the thought that counts. It's like the idea that right. is like this is practice for a real scenario. Mm -hmm. If if what Bastion is thinking is like, oh, I destroyed this building, I need to rectify that. Then that makes sense that it. he would go, get points back. Nice. nice. The ten. So, yeah, I, I agree. I think your 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 point score goes back up to five. Do I get any points? Any of the points that statue lost because I repair what he did. Uh, I yeah, I, sure. I guess is there a, is there but, a possibility but still there's duplicity clones in there? Still, mm. actually, you know uh, what? That is possible. That is a possible. I think that's. I think that's what I say. I say. I say. Good work, Bastion. All right, let's uh, do a search and rescue. That's what this whole thing whole thing is about, right? And then I like I rush in, try and look for people in yeah. the building. Can I? Can I make a? I, I guess, do I need to make a roll of some sort to do that? And if so, what? Um, to know if, if there are civilians in here? Uh, to either know or if I don't need to roll to know to just save them. Uh, well, it, it, to just save them would be savior. I'm trying to decide because... 
yeah, my, I guess my question is like, do can I just roll defend or do I need to like assess the situation or something to like find them? I think I'm good at both. That. Um, yeah, I guess I didn't make like a I guess. What would that role be? I think it would just be assess the situation. Yeah, it would be. Mm -hmm. To be like, are there I more people in here? Sure. Yeah. And, and then it's in the greatest you know, danger or whatever. I can also just assess the situation generally. And if I decide that if your answers tell me there's no point in doing this, then I can be like, okay, what do we do next? Or whatever. Sure. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm doing team leader stuff right now. Uh, all right. Bonus penalty. Anything? Oh, and just a note. Uh, no, no, no bonus or penalty. Okay. Just a note for, for you guys. I think like the buildings that are like directly around this are all like shorter. But I think as you get farther out, like all of these buildings are like some of these are like 10 stories high. All right, got a partial hit. Does that mean I just like ask less questions? Does that work? Uh, yes. So on a yeah. seven to nine, you ask one and take plus one while acting on the answer. So what here can I use to blank? What here is the biggest threat? What here is in the greatest danger? Who here is most vulnerable to me? And how can we best end this quickly? Um, I'm either asking uh, what here is in the greatest danger or how could we best end this quickly? The, the, the idea being, are there civilians here? Can I save them? Yeah, right. yeah. Um, I think they're... Uh, let me decide. Yeah, I think I'm going to say there's like uh, one in like each of these like little cubby rooms. Cool. Right. So there's there's definitely more points. Is to this get. something that Palladium can do on his own or do I need to coordinate a larger rescue? Uh, well, you can't grab five people all, all at once. I don't That's know. fair. Is Miss back from her triage? Yeah. Ten. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So these are all going down let me let me move them back can we hear the um back over here the, the judges when they were talking like the, the crucial thing is that playing in the stadium at all yes yeah so like as you guys okay. are so I, I, I that's actually part of I, i'm gonna i'm gonna try and make that as funny yeah, as well. possible the whole tournament um uh they're, they're so so statue like falls into the building right and and they're like they're like oh statue takes a good hit oh the building is falling out oh the building is falling out all over <laughs> he's caused a lot of damage negative points for him and then uh, um, Bastion repairs some of it and 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 uh, gives a thumbs up. And the judges are like, "Ah, uh, Bastion's getting some some uh, destruction points back for uh, uh, doing a patchwork job. Way to go, Bastion!" <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, do you, oh sorry, uh, Kim's and Wilson. Come on. Um, well, I just want to make sure. Like, so uh, I, I think I think Angel also that... comments on that and says, uh, "It doesn't look the best, though." <laughs> I certainly yeah. wouldn't live in that building. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead, Skip. Sorry. Well, I was just going to ask, like, is this something that Mist and I can do easily? Or, like, you know, that I don't feel like I would need anyone else's help with? Um, or would this be something where I'd be like, okay, Bastion, I need your help to, like, lift up the debris or whatever? No, no, no. These buildings are, or these okay. rooms are open. Yeah, you can just open doors. Sounds good. So, so that me and Mist are gonna do that because that's their thing. And then I would yeah. just, I would basically just like call back as I'm going out, call back to the others. I'm like, okay, mission's still on. Um, go ahead and uh, make sure that there's no other. Um, yeah, I, actually, I say, um, uh, Bastion, uh, Thunder, scout out the next building that we're gonna head to. Left wing, uh, left wing, Quantum. Make sure you're behind them to to run interference if if there's another team that gets in our way. We'll be right behind you. So left wing, I'm going to point out to you. Um, Ice Blade is yeah. coming in with one a clone, and uh, uh, Doomseer is coming. Is up it? Yeah, well. uh, yeah. Give me one sec. I'm going to switch places with Doomseer. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> yep. Uh, okay. So I would have done Ice Blade, but he gave us the he gave us the <laughs> plans. Yep. Yep. And so far, none of it's been a lie. So. Yep. I think I think you like lock eyes with Ice Blade and Ice Blade like shakes his head like don't you dare. <laughs> it's uh, uh go ahead and roll the switch places with uh, Doom Seer. Okay. I'm starting to like Ice Blade. He's kind of he, he's he's transitioned to being more of like a Sundere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, as soon as you get the episode with you know, with their tragic backstory or whatever, or the their like emotional attachment to their mentor, you know, right, and you yeah. start realizing. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, is is your uh, is, are you taking a condition or is it unstable or temporary? Um, can I say unstable? Can I it, can I suggest an option for unstable and temporary? Uh, you you can, but I, yeah. I don't have to take it. 
Yeah, well, I mean, sorry. Will you tell me if you take it before I choose that option? I guess that's maybe it. it depends okay. on what you say. My my th- th- thought was that I'll have time to get the duplicity in there, but then I'll have to like Doom Serial be on me and I'll have to fight her. Like she'll be uh, in base to base contact with me. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna um I'm gonna I'm gonna have a, have a bit. That's almost. why I want. There's it. there's a there's a uh, you have a what? I have a bit. That's why I want it. Oh, uh, you you want okay. Well, I was gonna say it's gonna be but, with somebody besides Doom Seer. Oh, okay. That's fine. Okay, okay. My bid uh, is with you, like but I can do it some other time. It's fine. <laughs> uh, well, I'm trying to decide. Did he fail? Yeah, no, we'll, 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 we'll do that. We'll do that. I'm, I'll, I'll do something else uh, he, as well. So, yeah, go ahead and switch. He's a civilian and he's in Doomseer's arms. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's a failure. If I'd failed, yeah, that would have been yeah. perfect. Yeah, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> so so, <laughs> so you, you swap places with her. Uh, and you, yeah, you, you bring her over and you like put her into the, um, the like That's elevator, yeah. um, uh, to like, uh, carry or like, put, like put her down and, and yeah, Doomseer is on you. Yeah. Like, just, thanks. You're doing that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so how do you, how do you protect anything? yourself from, from Doomseer? Does she say anything? Uh, <laughs> no. Okay. So I'm going to back off long enough and I'm like, so, so what counts as danger for your power? Oh no! Like just trying to like stay away from her. You know, uh, you know the bit. Yeah, I know the bit. Uh, um, so, so you back off from her, and uh, so, okay, yeah. well, actually, let me think about that. Uh, now nah, we'll just—I'll just give it to you. Yeah, uh, Doomseer. I was gonna say maybe uh, Doomseer could like take her off the elevator and then put her back on, but nah, I'm not gonna. I'm, nah, if that's yeah. possible, I'm gonna stand here and do that. Right, for right, and that, yeah. So yeah. That, that's why I'm. Yeah. Uh, so. I don't know if she's, I don't know what she says. I think, I think she just looks confused at you and she's like, shut up and fight left wing. All right. He's like, all right, no hard feelings. And then I'm going to go in like, I'm going to fight her and I'm going to try and kiss her. See if it yep. counts. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, what is this role? Um, um, provoke someone maybe? Yeah, I, that's, that's what it is. Cause I'm, I'm trying to get her to be confused enough that I have time to get away without fighting here. <laughs> okay. Um, well, do you want to do your confused role then? <laughs> oh yeah. I forgot. I have that. Um, um, are you watching close? Yeah. Are you watching, are you watching close? when you mislead, distract or trick someone? <laughs> no, that's totally perfect. All right. Yeah. I love this. Uh, oh man. Uh, I really hope he just gets absolutely punched in the face. All right, here we go. <laughs> no. no <full> hit. <laughs> okay. Um, uh okay so you tell me you tell me how this works we just can't lose yeah you can't well yeah and that means i will never upgrade ever yeah yeah. what what do you what do you what do you think is the most interesting here well like what's the role say because you have like you choose like three options right um well so if if i succeed they're fooled right yeah so i think i only pick something if i oh no i'm wrong on a 10 plus choose three okay i get an opportunity i expose a weakness or flaw I confuse them for some time. I avoid further entanglement. There's absolutely no chance I'm going to avoid further entanglement. So I'm just going to pick the other three. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We say those three again. Though. So I get an opportunity. Yep. I expose a weakness or flaw, which I think is inherent. That was what I was trying to yeah, do. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and I confuse them for some time, which was the other thing I was trying to do. Yeah. Uh, um, so the opportunity, I guess, I don't know. I mean, I could just be all rolled up to the same thing. That's fine. Uh, Unless you had something in mind for so, an opportunity. Well, so what what do you want to say happens here? So yeah, uh, what's your so opportunity? I think the idea is I go in to like punch, or like, or like she's she's coming at me. Yeah. So yeah. I like block a punch, and I go to punch her, and she goes to block, and then I like fake yeah, it, yeah. and I just move in with my face instead. <laughs> I'm just gonna try and like grab her and kiss her, and see if she stops me. Like because if she knew what was happening, she would stop me. Uh, um, I don't think she does. Or I don't. I don't okay. What's the answer? I mean, I, answer if, if I'm exposing a weakness, I think that she doesn't. Right. The Unless you answer, have like. A, the yeah, answer has to be she does see the future and doesn't stop it. <laughs> no, I don't think she would do that. that, that has to be the answer. answer. There'd, be, there'd be no way she'd do that. <laughs> if this that. was like mist or something, I would say absolutely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think she would. Uh, do that. But, that no, no, not, not, but like with her power, that. though, that is just a yeah. perfect scenario where it's like you, you're you're trying to gauge to see if she has her power still, and and she yeah. does see the future but doesn't stop it. <laughs> Right, oh, yeah. that'd be so good. That has, you need to so, keep that in mind for some uh, some other thing in the, in the future. So she yeah. doesn't see it. So do you kiss her then? Oh or yeah, do you yeah. stop. But okay, so you do kiss her. He, he has to commit um, to it. At least I'm assuming he has to. Co- and by by proxy, he is assuming yeah. he has to commit to it for her to see it. Right for it yeah, to count yeah. as danger. Yeah, for sure. Um, so yeah. so you kiss her, uh, and she is just like, 
uh, super confused and like pulls away from you. And it's just like, I guess that doesn't count. And then I'm going to try. <laughs> <laughs> so do you teleport with something else then, or do you just run? And she's just like too stunned to follow. Well, I think I'm just going to run. I don't know if I can. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you, so uh, yeah, you, you, where are you trying to run to? Um, so there's stuff going on over here. I actually do have a question. Can he, yeah. can this guy turn off his power? Yes. Okay. Yeah. He doesn't have like, that like aura around him currently. Okay. Um, Cause I'll probably you just switch with one of them. I don't know what he does yet, but yeah. I was like, I'll probably just switch with one of them and then do, do a doomsday can fight them. Um, but I was just trying to think of who I would switch with. Um, Oh, I'm gonna switch with laser guy. That's perfect. She can dodge his lasers. Okay, sure. Yeah. Um, so I think you I think you turn and and like uh are about to switch places with laser okay. pointer, but you did yeah. choose the avoid further entanglement option. So I'm gonna okay. say emoticon. I assumed that was gonna mean that I was gonna have to answer for doing that later. <laughs> oh, well, you do you have to do that no matter what. Um, I'm gonna say emoticon like jumps down from uh, <laughs> uh from like from a building. And uh, I think like uh, um, happy was in his his chest, and that comes out in its anger, and he's like, he's so mad at you. <laughs> and he, I'm gonna say he saw that uh, happen. Sure. Okay. And uh, um, he he like puts out his hand to like shoot a shoot a bunch of ice at you. Now can I switch places with my surfboard? Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> okay, yeah. Great. Thanks. Uh, I'm like, sorry, no time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Like I just uh, kissed a girl who can see the future, and she's gonna kick the crap out of me. So goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow, nice. Okay, so you switch places with this laser pointer, and uh, uh, laser pointer is like, "What the?" and gets like sprayed with ice and like falls to the ground. <laughs> um. <laughs> so uh, you, you swap places. Are you doing something immediately? I mean, you you got a, a good roll. Um, I I will, but I'll, we should let somebody else do something. I'm going to punch this null guy just because he's standing next to me. But we should let somebody okay. else do something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, Palladium, go ahead and roll to see how well you and Miss do with uh, um, these duplicity clones. Sorry, le left wing. You always leave things in the air, this or stuff, I always yeah. feel like it needs to so, be resolved. But here's, I, here's what we'll do. Yeah. I teleport, and I'm going to set my hand with the t the taser on this guy's shoulder, and be like, "Hey, what's up?" And then we'll cut. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got to. So just save here. Uh, yeah. Uh, I get a plus one because I'm acting on the answers for my previous Correct. role yep. there. <clears throat> All right. So it should it. be a plus four, I think, which is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I've been doing yeah. most of my freak stuff against these guys with plus four because of that. And yep. it's, it's amazing. Um, right, there you go. Nice, dude. So, so you and miss, I think so. Maybe, maybe you stop, get two stop. and miss gets three. Yeah. And, uh, um, you guys, me, Pull you around this way. So uh, I think when I think we, I, I keep them safe. As well, yeah. On on a, a, you, and I hit, you keep them safe and choose one. one. You can add a team um, to the pool. Take influence over some you protect or clear condition. We already decide that we're not take influence the, uh, over the teacher. Yeah, that's why we already we already <laughs> made that joke last time. Oh man, <laughs> um, clear a con. I don't have a condition, so I, I guess I'll just add team to the pool then. Cool. Yep. So now we're that's up it. to three team again. So um, because Palladium's never going to level up because he never fails rolls, we should have a yeah. thing where when you get 10 stars and go up to the next thing, you get a level up too. Uh, so no. Palladium can level up before the game ends. <laughs> it's fine. I'll play by the rules. Oh, as in like get a promotion? Yeah, like when, when you get 10 stars. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. I'll, I won't say it. Definitely. I'm mostly kidding. I know we're already cruising pretty fast on level ups. So. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm glad for these. Uh, yeah, these lame rolls for these, to be honest. Um. <laughs> It's been a lot of fun time. I'm not complaining. So, so you're you, you're bringing these uh, uh, clones over here, um, and mm -hmm. you see laser pointer and emoticon uh, like duking it out. Or uh, emoticon seems to definitely have the upper hand on uh, laser pointer, and laser pointer is trying him? desperately not to destroy buildings. Uh, yeah. Yes. Well, no, I think you you stunned her. Do you see her is like frozen? Like, <laughs> what just happened? 
<laughs> you you got a ten plus on that. So I want to get. Uh, I like, I like the thing is like the an, it's like the anime moment where like the dark cloud over their face and then just looking down at those <laughs> a close up on their on their face, looking down like at their hands, like no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. I'm going to get absolutely rocked when we get back. <laughs> yep. Oh man. Uh, I think I think like the announcers as well. They're like, and left wing comes. It, did he just kiss her? <laughs> and then we hear, is that allowed? Can he do that? Yeah. Ar- yeah ar- ar- <laughs> architects like your guys' classmates are messed up. <laughs> <laughs> no one from our school would ever do that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'd like to think that we, Connor, just for this is just for you. We pan over and there's suddenly an orc in the booth and he says, not not right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do you remember? Yeah. I, remember. <laughs> I don't know what that's a reference to, but it's funny anyways. <laughs> there's a great uh, Dungeons and Dragons comic series where it's like yeah. an oh, adventuring party stick. in a comic. No, it's not that. that it's uh, okay. it's like a graphic novel series, like the oh, like okay, official sure. graphic yeah. novel series. Oh, cool. Um, really, really funny. And there's a point where the, uh, this the fighter of the party is fighting an orc, like an orc chieftain. And he's totally and losing. He's totally losing, and so he's like, "I got to do something out of the box." And so he kisses him. He kisses the orc chieftain, <laughs> and all the other orcs are like, <laughs> like "Oh, that's that not really right." <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's come over to Bastion and Thunder. So the uh, statue like, mm-hmm. has just like a bunch of building that's just like fall fall fell down on him. Um. Mm-hmm. Left wing, you had to have given him his power back. So I think he's just like yeah. super hardened, but he doesn't know how to like move. So he's like protecting himself from like dying, but he's like, he, I he wish just I can't move in the, in the building. <laughs> uh, so you just finished like patching up the buildings so that Palladium and Mist could get all those clones out. But what were you doing in the meantime? Um, uh, Palladium did tell you to what? Go rescue or no, go scout out another building. Yeah, find but another building. You don't building. have to do what he says. It's up to you. I looked the thunder and like, we need more points. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Thunder's like, yeah, we do, and uh, is like, hey, Quantum, do, do you see a good building for us to go into? Um, and I think maybe Quantum points over here, since this one is uh, bigger than this one is. Which one? <laughs> oh, I see now. Uh, and I think Quantum maybe is like, um, well, you know, because you you told her to keep running interference so i think quantum quill uh points to that building over there and then says i'll go help left wing and like carries herself above them over here we we could always just go kill the giant robot uh (laughs) if you if you say that i think quantum quill is like oh hey that's a good point uh but i just haven't seen it yet they said it would be bigger right uh, and I think right as right like as she's Godzilla saying that comes around the corner. Um, yeah, yeah, for real. I think uh, um, like way over here, there's like a, a like a big like doorway that like opens up kind of like a like a rancor like door and, and a Lips. giant robot comes out. Let me sorry. I have a where token the, for that. Where was the ping? Uh, like over over here. Let me focus ping. OK, uh, okay. maybe over here in this corner here. Let me see. There's a way for me to like get a. Uh, I can't remember how I got a thing last time. There was there was like a certain character sheet that had that as a token. And I can't remember which one it was. You mean like the weird shadow thing? Yeah, a weird shadow thing. That's just what it does when you don't have a picture, I think. So if you find anything without a picture in Dragon On, which I don't think is anything. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just... Uh, yeah, well, add something here. There we go. Yeah, that's how big it is. Perfect, yeah. Yes, big. Right. Why does it look like a hooded <laughs> man? Uh, he doesn't have it, a picture well, for it. So, so I don't it's have a picture default. for it. Uh, I, I should have. I should have came up with something. Oh, so also, uh, so since we're seeing a, a bigger one, this is probably when you notice there seems to be kind of like a purple, like um, glow, kind of like underneath these things, as if like it's their life force. Um, mm-hmm. You didn't notice it before, but I think you do now. And it's like uh, I don't know. It doesn't look like the robots from like My Hero. It looks, uh, but it does look robot like. It's uh um it's made with like metal and um uh it it's got like uh this one has like maybe like some uh different like arms to it or whatever like uh like mechadendrites. Um, yeah, yeah, like uh it's got like not not like spider legs, but like like bigger like AT AT legs maybe. Oh okay, yeah. He's stompy. Cool. Do you shoot lasers? Uh, that is that remains to be seen. Oh, okay. 
I think it has. I think I think it has arms explosive. though too. So it, it looks cool. kind of like a. I don't if know, we both like destroy robot. it, do we split the points, or how does that work? I don't think you do because you're you're individ- So like th- this is set up specifically to be individually based. Mm-hmm. So I I think it's whoever like lands the killing blow is like who. Would All right, I've I've got this. an I've got an idea then for that. All right, what well, lay it on me? Well, I'm good. It's got to be in the moment, Connor. Oh, okay, okay. So, so you are I, you I, like? I turned, let's go. Uh, yeah, I turned to Thunder. Like, I just give her the nod. <laughs> <laughs> and Thunder's like, "Oh man, are you sure about this?" But it's like running after you. <laughs> and I say, "Well, we have, we have to learn from all of our." And I, I make sure that the people in the box hear this. <laughs> <laughs> well, if we have to learn from every one of our classes, from Mister Angel's class, do you remember my speech? Oh yeah, th- yeah. Thunder, Thunder gets like a grin on her face, and she's like, "I see what you're doing." And it's like, <laughs> "Yeah, you want to be a hero who destroys evil, and I got your back." And like gives you a wink. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. Uh, I mean, and we 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 run towards it, and then we either cut or get there. <laughs> uh it's well cool, so it's, guys. I, it's, I got it's this. pretty it's pretty far away but i think maybe you you like uh catch up to it like uh we, we do the the static shock thing where i make like a manhole out of out of like uh carbon and like we fly on it um i think it i think it's Silver like surfer. trying to like yeah. push through like this alleyway and it's like destroying parts of these buildings um how many points does godzilla lost so far uh, <laughs> yeah, we we don't see we don't see a point score for for him, but it would be a lot. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, well, well, you guys, you guys get there. Um, you guys, let's say, let's just say you guys are fast at this, and uh, go ahead and go ahead and uh, go ahead and make a roll. All right, or I'm going you, to or um, tell me what you do, I suppose, because we don't make rolls before. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm going to use my my new move. Oh, okay, or, okay, or maybe not my new one of my moves. Um, game face. Oh, okay. When, yeah, when you, you commit yourself to save someone or defeat a terrible enemy, mark a condition and take plus one. Yep, yep. Well, I I'm going to you. mark yeah. guilty because it's partially my fault that Thunder lost a bunch of points. Okay, sure. Yep. And I wasn't able to get her any points back. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, all right. So, help Is me. Is your figure goal out- then to let her have the finishing blow? No, no. We'll, we'll get, we'll get there. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah. Is this. Something that I can unleash my powers on or not. Because it's like no, reshaping think... the environment. Well, it depends on what you're trying to do. Or... Yeah, I don't I don't know. If you're trying to hurt it, then you're um you're doing yeah. direct engage. But if you're just trying to like set up something to allow you to hurt it, that's yeah. could be either, I guess, up to Connor. Yeah. Like I assume but... you're gonna have to do some stuff before you're allowed to directly engage a threat on this thing, right? You're probably going to have to reshape your environment a couple of times before directly engaging it's an option, right? Because it's indestructible. It, it, I guess that it, would yeah, be my they, they did. Okay, so let me let me just just for clarification, Bastian. They they did tell you that this is a bad strategy. That you're just supposed to like keep things safe from this, and and this is worth fifty points. So if you rescued five civilians, you'd get as much as this. Yeah, which missed. Yeah, it's not like in here, Academia, where destroying it was like. Uber points you know, or whatever. Unless that's one of the secret rules. Uh, yeah, yeah. There's, <laughs> but they you know. did basically tell you not to fight it. So if anything, yeah. the secret rules might be like you disobeyed orders, you lose points. Mm-hmm. I'm going to reshape the environment to kind of like see if we can just trap it. Um, that's a good call. Okay. Uh, what what would you what what would that look like? Basically, just filling all of its joints and like with carbon and she's gonna help me make more carbon by like destroying the environment and like launching stuff at him so if she's destroying the environment she'll lose points well not uh, she can't destroy the ground to make more well, carbon. She can, can she use the stuff he's been walking through there's a bunch of debris right yeah they won't yeah care but about then that. You'd, you'd have to like come around behind i guess i guess unless you can just control carbon that you see from super far away like if there's a bunch of carbon over here you can just pull it to you I mean, yes. <laughs> yes. I, I mean, there's probably say. stuff by his feet, right? Like, yeah, you know, sure. Like around here. We'll, we'll say it's a gray area. The judges give you the benefit of the doubt. Uh, so, okay. So, you. Yeah. When you're fighting you, Godzilla, there's not going to not be collateral damage. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It's unnecessary but collateral they did damage. But they did tell you this is a bad strategy. So, that might be part of why they did that. 
Yeah. Um, okay. So yeah. So you, you fill it, you, you, you are trying to fill its legs with, with carbon and weigh right. it down. Help, help me find a way roll. that she could realistically help. In this. It's- uh, I mean, in my opinion, you could static shock her carbonly, like carry her with carbon above it. And she could just land on it and disintegrate the whole thing. Yeah. I mean, she's like super overpowered. She could probably destroy it. Okay. All right. So yeah, we we fly up together on the disc. Okay. And like at the last second, like like the what's it called? Like the power twins. We like grab hands and then attack at the same time. So they can't tell who did it. <laughs> and then you turn to, to mist in her hands. <laughs> uh yeah, I don't think They um... can't they, they can't know they'll have to split the points, Connor. Well, I think that's a roll, right? I mean, I think that's yeah. like a um a like provoke, superior. provoke someone. Yeah, maybe yeah, like that. Um but okay, so but as so let, let let's before you do provoke okay. someone to try and provoke them into okay. you know, giving first. you both the points. Yeah, I want you to roll um I want you to roll freak first to see if you evade. Mm-hmm. So like your your mission mis- whoop. You're you're changing your environment to reshaping your environment to get yourself above him, right? And I think he's like swinging with his giant robot oh, arms to like stop the... you. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do three rolls then. Uh, well, I think basically you're setting her up. She doesn't. She isn't gonna roll, right? To like actually. Yeah, correct. Okay. Oh, I'm um, gonna do the auto Ted. <laughs> spend two. Well, well, you could just okay. you could just spend a team on on her. She can just help you, right? Like that's kind of what she's there for, technically. I guess, and this isn't. To, That's up to you. This is yeah, just and there is yeah I'll, I'll spend. I'll spend one team to make it a seven, and then. Uh, so I think as one of the robot arms is coming in, she's like, "Look out!" and like lifts up her like arms with the vibration and like shinks off a piece of its arm as it's uh, uh, coming at you, like just barely to avoid you guys being. Like, she's terrifying. Knocked That's into insane. the air or knocked into the ground. Mm-hmm. Um, she, she's literally like overhaul, maybe worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, crazy. So, uh, so you get, so you get above it, right? Mm-hmm. So now the question is, um, if you're gonna attack it at the same time, I'll just say, um, you you would just spend team to invoke her as a uh, a bonus oh, wait. to I'm, your. I'm d- hey, I'm I'm dumb. I'm sorry. Go ahead. What? Um, we don't spend the team because I have plus one ongoing. <laughs> Uh, to what? To oh, just, to, for game to, face. To That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you don't yeah. spend the time. I'm, I'm sorry. So, I'm, I'm, I'm a double. But boy. we'll just say she still does chink it just yeah, for fun. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so then, okay, so you're above it. Sorry, I'm, this is like <laughs> trying to keep everything in my mind. Mm-hmm. Uh, Good, no oh, thank you, Kip. So you're above it. So th- there's two roles. One would be if you're trying to attack it and get the points mm-hmm. yourself, that's a danger role to try and attack it and destroy it, right? Yeah. Uh, and you just trade blows. That doesn't like like succeeding at a danger roll doesn't mean you necessarily destroy it. You're just trading blows. Uh-huh. Uh, and then the like combination, the provoke one or the provoke someone that would be to convince them that you both did it at the same time. But you'd also mm-hmm. have to spend team to in- invoke her power to be in your attack with the danger yeah. roll. So those are the three things that have to. Oh, be. I thought we were doing freak. I mean, to, like trap it instead of destroying it. I, I was under the impression that he wasn't really doing anything to hurt it, that she was killing it. He was his role was about making it look like the two of them did it together, right? Like he's not actually hurting it at all, so he wouldn't make a a directly yeah. engaged threat. I thought at I, all, he right? said he said he was doing a Wonder Twins thing where they were going to hold hands and attack at the same time. I didn't right, but I, I don't think he, he can actually hurt it, the uh, right? trap thing. I mean, att- attack is yeah. is a and this system is a is a loose term because it could mean a bunch of different. Moves. Yeah, I, I assumed he was he was like his role was getting hurt there, and then his other Correct. role is just making it look like they're fighting it together when he, they're not, and he's trapping just... it so she has a. Okay, so what what do you want? Sure. What do you do next? So you're above it now. Okay. So you're in position. Right. So what do you do next? So I trap it. So that would be a freak roll. Yeah. And you're using carbon just to like pin its legs down, basically. Is there is there actually a reason to do that mechanically, like? Because to give her like to plus. give her an opening, that's one of the. But does she sure. need that? I guess. Like Connor, uh, is, is she able to do this without an opening? It, like, if they you, need to slow it, down? I mean, it, she would need to be on top of it, right? So if if you if you're like, all right, Thunder, now's your chance. Jump on top of it and attack it. 
that's something you could tell her to do. Um, and mm-hmm. then in which case you're either spending team and attacking it together, or that's like a, um, oh, 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 Jared, she has her moment of truth. You're right. Oh. That's right. So, so you could just be like, Thunder, like, this is your this is your time to shine. So let me go, let me go and look at that role. I completely forgot man. about that. Um that's pretty sick. Yeah. Yeah, she literally has her over the truth. This could be where you use it. She finally has a, um, a, a opponent she can just let loose a hundred percent on and like Yeah, yeah. That's definitely. Cool. Yeah, for sure. So this is kind of like the closure for her for her arc here. Um, yeah. well, not her like entire arc, but like we get some flashbacks. Of- so this is yeah. Palladium and left wing's voices in her head and Bastion's voices in her head being like, yeah, yeah, yeah. you just gotta yeah. And and uh and left wing saying it if if uh if you point a gun at something, you have to be willing to live with uh, the consequences. The yeah. Uh so the, their role is Avengers them. Assemble. When you trigger a peer's moment of truth, roll plus team. On a 10 plus, choose two. On a seven to nine, choose one. On a miss, their great moment goes horribly wrong. Uh so the oh, options boy. that you can choose are they neutralize or stop an appropriate threat, they remove someone or something from danger for the time being. They create a unique opportunity for a PC to get the upper hand. They make you look good. Mark school advancement. Um, yeah. I do. Uh, do And uh, you're rolling plus team. So currently the team is at a plus three. Well, okay. I assume that meant you'd have to spend team and you're rolling plus how much team you spent. Oh, that's a great idea. Because otherwise that is a way more balanced mechanic. Yeah. yeah, I was super nervous about that mechanic because I was like, I have no idea how <laughs> keep the team, team forever gonna... and never spend yeah. it. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. Yeah, yeah. three team. And I think that's actually a pretty common, basis. not common. I think that's a thing that other games, Apocalypse World games, do too. Right, we have like, a resource like that. Spend. Yeah, mm-hmm. right. Yeah, I don't know so, if I want to so do that. Then. Let me let me rephrase. I mean, go for it. Let me rephrase. They neutralize or stop an appropriate threat. I just want to make sure this is I set the right precedent for this. Um, yeah, I mean, if she kills I'm a giant gonna, robot, say, they trade assume. blows. They trade blows with a um, like they they trade blows uh, with an appropriate threat. So, like, my my thought with this is this is them going all out with their powers, but I right. I, I never want them to be like uh, like you choose that option and you for sure kill somebody, right? Like you take yeah. out the enemy it's- boss because. The NPC, yeah. you want the NPC to do it. I'm like, that's it's not as way. good as a player's moment of truth, right? Exactly. Uh, yes. You you should have another option though, then, um, to have it be the equivalent of freak, where you just like stop, like overcome an obstacle. So that's they create a unique opportunity for a PC to get the upper hand, or they make you look good. Mark school advancement. Yeah, an so opportunity that, so, pretty so that, that's pretty okay. Yeah. I see. What you're saying. You, you don't want yeah. anything to be like they solve the problem with this. Well, no, so they so they could. It dep- that's why I'm saying an appropriate threat. They trade blows with an, with an yeah, appropriate but, but threat. Yeah, but so they can an appropriate threat. To something. An appropriate threat could also be an obstacle. Like I, I don't see a way um, for them to just like <clears throat> reshape the environment or. So that would be like a building unique gonna opportunity. Fall on can. Yeah, a building's going to fall on someone. You can't trade blows with the building, but it, fr- from the looks of it here, it doesn't look like they can actually. They stop remove the someone from or something from danger for the time being. That would be that. Uh, what like if stuff. if there's no one in danger and the building's just falling? So the da- the building is removed from danger, I guess. Uh, okay. probably, I, guess I feel like we could probably yeah, find right, one for right. whatever. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, I'm not. I'm not concerned about it. I mean, if that was the case, we would just that that would be. Yeah, I, I think if, if we come into a place where it, there isn't an option, I'm sure you can just yeah. get some. Yeah. All right, so uh, Bassie, it up to you. If you if that so I, that is the moment of truth rule, you can use it. You don't have to. Can I, because at this rate, she's not going to get any pluses on that, right? Right. We, so currently, you've spent zero team. We have three, so you could spend up to three. Yeah, correct. Yes. Oh, so oh, she, yeah. okay. Roll plus team. Spent. Thank you. Can I set up a situational advantage to give her a plus one to that roll? No, I don't think so. The only way to get situational advantages mechanically is to assess the situation. Which I mean, you probably could have done, but no. Yeah, I think you could have done like that before was you're like, inside of this situation. I need to read the the moves. Um, so, like comfort or support might be what you're thinking. Well, like if I reshape the environment to trap it, would she not get a plus one on attacking it? No. So, th- so that's more like so that's just changing the narrative, right? So, okay. So let me okay. let's put it this way. So when I, that's I the reason I you, I changed this to be like they trade blows with an appropriate threat. Mm-hmm. So depending on the narrative, it depends on how much damage they actually do to it. So if you're like, oh, I trapped it, 
that mm-hmm. could potentially add to the narrative of how much damage they deal, so to speak. Okay. But in this situation, I really don't think trapping it would do that. I wasn't sure what your idea was with that. I thought your idea was for trapping it was like it's going to stop dealing damage to the buildings, and that'll well, make no, it no, it's good. gonna, it's gonna. Well, I mean, I guess doing this would do that. I'm gonna coat all of its joints with like hardened carbon, so it can't like swing or walk. Giving stopping it from attacking the buildings and giving her a so, clear. So shot I to think attack. I think if you want to try that, I think you I think you would just succeed on putting carbon on it, but I don't think it like actually slows it down a significant amount to where that's what, that's it's like a. Well, no, I think I, so. Like that would be so in in this circumstance. Okay, so let's put it this way. Mm. This so the the narrative I'm not, is I'm always not powerful enough to do that. Well, no, I think this robot is too powerful for some hardened carbon to like. Okay slow down it's just super heavy it probably his joints are probably just crushed him. but also yeah. like i don't know that like it's probably slow enough that i don't know that her getting to its problem right like, if this was like correct super well you're fast, already then... you're already to it you already yeah, rolled like, to like be above it i think you did the thing I guess, yeah right like you did you the already thing to set get her, her there you set yeah. her there up to to be in position to do this i think that makes sense i and guess mechanically theoretically spend all three of the team yeah, right. you could. Oh, yeah. I I was expecting you to definitely do that for sure. But, okay. okay. You know, I, I just, to, just making sure. I, I just want to know what the rules are before we potentially destroy the entire test. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to uh, make a sacrifice to absolve my guilt and just let her get the get the points. Uh, you just push her off instead of going with her. Oh, sure. So you're going to clear guilty, you mean? Yeah. Okay. So, well, that was, so that would be depending on if <laughs> this works. So you should roll that first and then be like, that's me letting her get the points to clear guilty. Well, what am I? I thought I was a rolling. Oh, she, well, she has to roll that, right? So, so that's you rolling. So when oh, you trigger a I'm Pierce moment of truth, okay. you roll plus team spent. So, so you are, you're saying go thunder. Yeah. Use, thunder, go. <laughs> yeah. Use, use, thunderbolt. Use, use thunderbolt. Yeah. I, <laughs> I also thunder. think, I also think this would be a cool moment to explain why she's using her truth moment of truth here, right? Like you were going to go down with her and share the points. And then I think you're like, oh, but if I just let her do this yeah. and go wild, then this maybe yeah. will help. Right. So maybe you're like, hey, you know, cut loose. Yeah. <laughs> like you, yeah. Don't, you don't have to be worried about this point. Right. And then you just let her do it. Mm-hmm. I think that and would she, be And she's cool. like, aren't we going to try and split the points? I don't put words in your mouth so you can say how you want to say yeah. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. So I, I, are we like falling at this point towards it to attack it or? That's, you're standing that's on a you. manhole cover you're, above you, it, aren't you? Yeah, you, yeah. you brought her on a manhole cover of mm-hmm. carbon. I, I just push it. her off and yell, show me what you're made of. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, thun- uh, uh, Thunder is stunned and then, and then like smiles up at you and then like starts glowing super uh uh, hard in her her hands are just like boom 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 boom, and you feel the like vibrations, uh, uh, mm-hmm. like on your disc, and I think maybe even like the carbon disc you're on, like like starts, starts to flake. like crumble, and you have to like get to a building, and obviously you just do, mm-hmm. um, but it's like I like to think you, that he like he's 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 using the carbon that's like falling apart from the manhole yeah. cover, and then like yeah, forming like it into a step, a forming it into a step, <laughs> yeah, and then it crumbles, yeah. and he forms it into another step, and he keeps <laughs> yeah. like hopping down to the building. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, and this building is tall too. So you, you get to it and then are able to turn and look as she like falls on it and uh she just comes midair lets lets loose. But go ahead and roll though, because this on a miss, their great moment goes horribly wrong. So um, roll plus it uh I think it's just a flat roll. So just do the influence one, I think, right? Yeah. Like on your Push. character sheet, you can just roll having her fall and uh, is maybe not the best idea. Their great moment goes horribly wrong is definitely going to be the one thing. <laughs> it just keeps I, dissolving I can, I can, until she goes can, to the center of the earth and kills the entire planet. Oh, that so was there's my a thought flat exactly. 2d6 roll. So that's uh, underneath this sum of five labels and underneath reject influence. You can just roll flat 2d6 and then Let's go. bonus there. Nice. Are you nice. guys fine with me spending two, two team? Well, I think you got to spend the team yeah, first. Yeah, you got to right? spend it beforehand. But, oh, you, didn't but you said you were going to spend three, didn't you? Well, no, I didn't because I thought you did that after. Uh, well, right, it, but you it, were planning it's, it's on spending three, right? I mean, it, to get it to ten, probably. I mean, are you guys cool with that? What? Well, uh, yeah, I mean, I thought you were going to spend three when, and I knew that you had to do it before the roll. So let's oh. let's re-roll. Let's let's <laughs> let's have you re-roll, and you just decide how much team you you want to spend into it. Well, I was going to spend enough to make it ten. Right, but right, he needs so to, what I'm you saying have to spend is, it before, I think you should spend it before. Right? So I think you should like, re-roll. 
and decide how much team you put yeah. into it. So this is like rolling with a stat, but the stat yeah. is how much team did you spend? Yeah. Right. So okay. you have to decide beforehand. Yeah, how much you should you should spend. add that to the your little description. Yeah, I mean it's uh, okay. Yeah. yeah, roll plus team spent right, before so the roll. Wait, what? Oh, you didn't add the three, but you're gonna do three. Okay. Yeah. All right, <laughs> you tricky little boy. What you're kind of you're supposed to add it to the modifier. Yeah, because uh, then it's like, oh, that's fine. It's fine. It's, it was, yeah, we, if you do it again, you're gonna times. fail. So, so it, when when you when you yeah. put oh, he still didn't do it when you put in the um, no, he did. Put, he got a seven. No, uh, that was that was the joke because you said <laughs> seven, this, the middle one's the real one. <laughs> uh, I'm all so we're going with the second one plus the three, but yeah. uh, um. For, yeah, I was gonna. I, that, the question I was gonna ask you is if you could put in a modifier. I thought that was maybe the excuse yeah, as to yeah, why you didn't. You but <laughs> it did it. It's like a situation. Like how it says roll thing. something. That's funny. Yeah. Uh, okay, so Otto, let me go back up to that to scroll up now to see the move. So he gets two. Um, you get two. Right. So they trade blows with an appropriate threat. I'm sure you're choosing that one. Mm-hmm. They remove someone or something from danger for the time being. They create an out unique opportunity for a PC to get the upper hand, or they make you look good. Mark a school advancement. Um, there's not one for avoiding damage, is there? She's not. She's, she's not taking, taking damage. damage. Oh, oh, this say they trade blows, which kind of does imply that they take damage. Oh, I yeah, shouldn't that, say that. Yeah, uh, yeah. Trade blows means they also get hit. Yeah, I was just copying why I was so the, confused. Like, yeah, I was. So maybe you can say like they go full out against an appropriate target, yeah, and then that yeah. means yeah, that can mean go. different things depending on this narrative, right? Like, if she went full out on Tempest, nothing would happen. <laughs> Right. Right. Yeah. That's that's that was the trick I was trying to put in there. Right. Is that it's Although like, I don't know, she seems pretty crazy. Oh, Maybe yeah, she would kill him. Crazy. Yeah. Um, if she could destroy this oh, guy. Want, I'm sorry. Do you want a juice? Uh, no, thank you. You should just have her make you look good. <laughs> yeah, I was going to do that. I, I think you're going to use that. So I guess let me put it this way. So um, if uh, you can either say you mark a school advancement, or I will uh, uh, give you uh, there, there's there's a secret thing that I have in here um, that I could, I could give you that instead. Well, what's it's up the to you. secret thing? Well, I, I, don't I don't know if I want the secret thing. Huh? Is it, is it a secret uh, so thing either, related, gonna to be related to points in this tournament? phase or okay. so let me, let's put it that way. You can either get a, a, a school advancement, which is just the teacher seeing you and being like, that was awesome. We're just going to award him an advancement because he's, he's learning and growing, or mm. you is can be awarded secret points in this phase. Up to you. Mm-hmm. Which one's better, Connor? I mean, I think school advancement is better just simply because uh, like getting secret points in this may or may not get you the advantage, depending on how you do in the rest of this. So yeah. I think school advancement is a, a cleaner uh, um, option. So far, uh, yeah. only Ice Blade scored points, right? Uh, what do you mean? Other than us, only Ice Blade has scored points, except well, for in terms of in terms of civilian points, yeah. yes. But... Right, right. Uh, but uh, um there's also what's it called social destruction um, yeah the, yeah, the combat uh, points, yeah the combat yeah right uh how many advancements do i have uh three yeah I'll so do, you would I'll, get up I'll to four i'll take it go for it. That's fine. okay i i actually already put it on there so oh, I, nice. I thought you had already said yeah but all right so so you're <laughs> up to four now okay so so yeah we'll we'll get that scene though too so um it's actually a little uh, emotional. I imagined that as an animation, and it was that was pretty good. Oh yeah, for sure. So she good. like so she she turns up and smiles at you, and then and then uh, I think she says thanks, and uh, like uh, imagine her pivoting in midair, turning thing. and yeah, pivot. Yep, and then she just <laughs> yeah. like I don't think she ever touches it. I think it yeah. melts as she goes through that's, it. That's what I imagined. Um, also, yep. And then I think, uh, oh, how does she survive though? Uh, maybe, maybe that's part of you looking good is you catch her with carbon as she's falling down. Yeah. Um, and she just, uh, I don't know. You like make like a slide of carbon that's or something. That's exactly for what her. I was describing. Yeah. I was assuming like, she was going to land on like a giant pile of sand. <laughs> Metal sand. Uh, that, I mean, that could work <laughs> but, yeah. too, but, uh, I think it, I, yeah, I don't think it, works. I don't think it turns into sand. I think it literally like falls into pieces. Um, well, like yeah, just like yeah, it's gotta have like base atoms and... at least, right? Like, yeah, yeah, there's enough of it that I would. I mean, it's fine, it's fine. I, I like the idea that Bastion saves her. I just, yeah, <laughs> figured she was gonna land on something uh, soft. So, so all in one below, though, and then she yeah, she lands crazy. and like looks up at you, Bastion. And I think there's like a little bit of like a tear in her eye, uh, and she like uh blinks it away, uh, right away, but then she looks up at you and says, 
women. Wow, that was exhilarating. <laughs> yeah, that was dope. <laughs> <laughs> and like the second she looks away like bash just like oh. yeah <laughs> like it's like yeah i could have died <laughs> like i didn't realize how much danger i was in yeah i'm yeah. in danger yeah and i think uh, i think the announcers are like completely silent and uh um duplicity is like thunder has just completely destroyed one of the giant figures in one blow with the help of bastion to stop her fall that was incredible. And I think uh, Mnemonic and, and uh, Architect are like l- l- just in complete shock. Like, what the crap are you guys teaching these kids? <laughs> uh, this reminds me of the scene in, New- in My Academia in the tournament when uh, um, t- uh, geez, the Fire and Ice guy. Um, oh, he yeah, yeah. Shoots Tutorati. ice in the whole arena. Like, it pans out and you just see above mm-hmm. the arena ice comes out. And I was like, <laughs> How is he in a class with these other people? He's literally yeah. a god. <laughs> yeah, for real. It's ridiculous. Um, so yeah, she just completely melts it. Uh, but we'll, So we'll cut from there back over to, to left wing. Um, and I think Palladium and Mist, right. you guys are putting the, these duplicates back into the, the thing. Are you going to help? Uh, <laughs> how, does, how does this fight going between... Uh, Emoticon and, and Laser Pointer? And, Emoticon and, and Laser Boy. Um, I think Doomseer... Uh, is doing like some cool matrix stuff to like escape being lasered to death. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And uh, uh, <laughs> um, I think Emoticon like gets the upper hand and just like completely encases him in ice. It's that it's just like his head above the, above the ice nice. and then is like uh, um, uh, running after left wing. Oh, okay. Um, I, so yeah, I put my hand down in the X hand. Like how's it going? And well, then I, I look I think, over. I think Emoticon says, or no, I think Doomseer says to laser pointer and says, um, uh, uh, feel free to take as much destruction dam- damage points as you want by trying to get out of there. <laughs> as in, like, if you do that, you're going to laser a bunch of buildings. Right, yeah. And a maybe, like, like other that. civilians. Um, yeah, yeah. I uh, set my hand on, on Null's shoulder, and like, hey, what's up? And they look over, and I see thunder fall through the sky and destroy a giant robot. I'm like... And then I taste it. <laughs> 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 um, and I think we see... I wanted part of my upgrade to be like, so I've got the, the detachable taser on my arm. And yeah. now we see there's like, there's like the uh, wires that go through the knuckles, like uh, the, the, or rather the uh, spaces between the fingers and out of the yeah. palm. And there's like a little taser apparatus that comes out. So I can like oh, tase nice. people with it m- manually. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. Um, so yeah, I basically try and tase them with my, my thing. Uh, I guess roll danger. All right. I just upgraded my danger. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. That was oh, a plus. There you go. That was a plus three. Oh, nice. <laughs> I got a seven. Oh, I tried to fail. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, okay, so on a seven to nine, you pick one. So you you trade blows and can either resist or avoid their blows, take something from them, create an opportunity for your allies, impress surprise, or frighten the opposition. I'm just going to avoid taking a blow, I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So uh, uh, you, you shock him. And uh, I think as he's being shocked, his power activates. Mm. And um, uh, you just feel like this uh, this emptiness, uh, or, or, or like, and and your your power. I, I guess because mm-hmm. you can see the the power. Um, so, mm, so yeah, let me explain this. Like? So so um, uh, Bubble Boy and Blink are technically next to him. So yeah. uh, you, you he activates it, and I think um, you see his power um, uh, like soul. Uh, it, I think normally they're like like bluish in nature a lot of the times sure. or like purplish in nature um mm-hmm. and this one uh is normally like a dull thing kind of like how you see yours mm-hmm. um or like how how you see people's are like dormant sometimes they're not being used they they look mm-hmm. like uh they're just like yeah. active and when they are active they like glow yeah uh, mm-hmm. this one when it glows it like inverts mm-hmm. and uh and uh, uh kind of looks like a bl- a little black hole kind of to you Neat. and okay. uh uh as it like spreads you see all the like power sources in uh kind of like as if they're like being pulled towards him inside mm. of it and basically just takes all the glow from it mm, okay. uh, he, he drinks and, all their stormlight yeah mm-hmm. basically yeah okay, and uh, cool. uh you just see like a, this like weird brown yellowish like uh aura emanate from him and uh um after you finish tasing him uh he he like uh, like looks at you and goes to like punch you 
And uh, hey, that's my trick. Yeah, anyway. yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. But but he he looks strong. He's like oh, he great. like uh, he looks like he's he's a buff guy, like a, a mm-hmm. like a bodybuilder. I figured he probably and, uh, has to do a lot of physical fighting since his power isn't very offensive. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So he's definitely trained the most in like uh, mm-hmm. just physical prowess. So uh, yeah, he takes a swing at you. And uh, uh, you like dodge it. And I think he maybe like hits the wall and <laughs> and like uh, uh, like takes a chunk Cracks of the it. wall with him. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And uh, uh, he's like, you're not the only one who can take powers. Try and fight me now. OK. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, I'll keep fighting about we. We can do something else if you want, but. Uh, keep, so keep going me, I'm gonna, I'm stuff. gonna say uh bubble boy and, and blink are like come on no not around us and uh like run away from uh from him to like get their powers back yeah um okay. <laughs> and then palladium mist are you guys what, what's the next thing you're doing you guys just saved a bunch more civilians um so remind me what have, what has happened since we did that so the, obviously the giant, giant robot got disintegrated. So, um, yep. Emoticon and Doomseer have mm-hmm. just encased laser pointer over here in ice and are running towards left wing. Okay. Actually, I don't think Doomseer is. I think, I think you probably turn and look and, and uh, Doomseer is like, Emoticon, just let it go. And uh, emo- yeah, thanks. <laughs> He's a great kisser. He deserves to be alive. <laughs> <laughs> what? No. <laughs> You're reading his <laughs> character so wrong. Uh, no, I know. It's funny though. <laughs> um, I, I I don't know if I think Emoticon is like like torn right now between like he totally wants to beat up Left Wing and uh, Doom is like we just need to score points. And then what, like what else is happening around me? So obviously Left Wing is by Null and he what, uh, tased him. Bubble Boy and yeah yeah Left Wing just tased Null. Null just punched a wall and it looked like it did damage. Mm-hmm. Uh, and now they're like going all mano all mano. Uh, statue is still stuck in here. I think Quantum Quill is coming yeah, where's, over. Where's she? I think Quantum Quill probably engages with Blink and Bubble Boy. I think she, she's probably like attacking them with like uh, um, <laughs> ball bearings. I think is what we decided. Can I, here, can, oh, I'll just yeah. can I just make a. I think Palladium looks around to see what the best thing to do is. Can I just assess, assess the situation, situation to see like what you know what some weak points are? Where maybe with this or people I can <laughs> save? Like yeah. a building that's being ignored by other people. Yeah. 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 Uh, those are all different questions that you could uh, yeah, ask the answers to. So go ahead and roll. All right. I don't think I have any bonuses or anything on this. So we're good. And uh, let's say, let's say other people have like cycled in and are like delivering yeah. civilians too. I'm not going like, to keep track of all of them though, especially because left wing has, is can't teleport right now. True. So I don't True. have to worry about him <laughs> needing to steal everybody is conveniently <laughs> everybody shows up right now yeah. <laughs> um yeah so i get to ask one question um unless actually i got i do have there's team still right Not no anymore. there I'll is currently to, zero no, team zero team okay yep. <laughs> we had it. team and then we disintegrated a I, I, could robot and I, don't, I, I think i missed team. what how much he spent on it <laughs> oh, okay yeah. missed <laughs> oh boy Very that's nice. who i was going to ask for a team but or yep. use team four. Uh, let's see. Assess. What kind of here can I use to blink? What here is the biggest threat? What here is the greatest danger? Who here is the most vulnerable to me? How could we best end this quickly? So uh, what's the state of the board in terms of points and stuff? Yeah, good question. I'm also curious. Um, like, okay. obviously, Palladium and Mist have some good amount of points because they've been just been saving people the entire time. Yeah, Palladium and Mist are, are probably in the top 10. Mm-hmm. Um, I honestly, Mist might be pretty close to the top. Because mm-hmm. she's been able to save a lot of people. Because I mean, combat points um, don't give you as much as saving, right? So I mean, unless and other people haven't been saving, correct. so theoretically they should be at the very top. Unless other people have done so much combat. A lot of people that... have done a ton of combat. So okay. Green Tiger and Fuego both have a ton of combat points. Okay. Um, Emoticon has probably even with Palladium, but not quite as many as Mist. Um, okay. And uh, I don't know, maybe Shorty has some good. Um, uh, what's it called savior points red saber and soul impact also are in the top 10 with combat points uh soul bound shinobi is maybe like 11 and uh ice blade uh has some combat points but probably more like top 15 okay so uh, my Alchemist question then has some good combat points my question then since we're kind of in like what mid-tier top five uh yes 
yeah, me missed. I, I want to ask the question, how could we best end this quickly? And by end this, I mean, get to the top, right? Like what's a way that we can get yeah. a bunch of points fast? Um, like is, especially, you know, if, is there a building a unique opportunity? Let's say, right, right. Is there a citizen, a group of citizens that we can easily save under someone's nose? Um, let's say like, are there like people fighting over That'd some citizens and then I can just sneak in and yeah, be like, oh, let me, they're mine let me now. Say, let me say, let me bring in a new team. Yeah. Let me bring in Bioelastics team. I'm only halfway through dismantling this other team. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, everybody's just like all over, right? Yeah, so let, yeah, let me, know. I'm going to say that Bioelastic and his team come out and everybody has Jimmy. civilians. Um, uh, and like, so I'm going to say if uh, you could... If you want to try and well, I don't know if this is a great opportunity, though. No, I, I don't know. I would want to steal savior points from people who are on their yeah, way to the yeah. triage. I would want to like take advantage of because I'm thinking about this in terms of public image too, right? Like, yeah, I that's would a want, good point. I want to want it to be like this: like a team is fighting over citizens and ignoring the citizen's safety because they're fighting over them. Yeah, and then we sure. Swoop let's in do and do the savior thing, right? Let's do that. So let's say, let's say, um, let's say it's inside this building. Let me grab these this group. They're inside this building, sure. um, and then let the me Southwest. grab one of one of uh, our team or your guys' school team. Let's say Ice Blade uh, grabbed that civilian is coming back, and he's with his team. And let's say let's say they're all just like duking it out. Uh, and <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's I like I like that idea a lot. Um, so let me grab his team. Polar shield, so impact. Is yeah, is it, Palladium has is a it a style than left wing? Ooh, Flutter's probably outside yeah. though. Um, oh, yeah, true. And uh, uh, Fuego, they're all on team two. So Flutter, Flutter is probably. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say these five, right, are fighting these six, uh, but they're also like fighting like robots and stuff too, or not robots, mm -hmm. inanimate objects. Um, as they're like trying to make way for them to grab civilians. Um, but there's a bunch of civilians in this building in particular. And maybe this is like a four story building. Um, and Flutter is carrying six civilians to the triage. Uh, but there are more in the building. So that's an opportunity you could take from a uh, Flutter, but obviously you don't want to. So you don't have to. I'm just, mm -hmm. uh, Flutter wouldn't be in this building trying to fight. Flutter is. Yeah uh living her best life <laughs> flying around and saving civilians. saving people yeah yeah i'm not going to worry about flutter but you, you're saying the other teams are fighting over civilians inside the building basically yes okay so i basically me and me and me and mist i i turned to mist and i'm like all right you want to do some real hero work while the yeah yeah while yeah. these kids while these kids play in the sandbox yeah uh she's she she says um she says absolutely yes sir <laughs> Yeah, and so my goal is to be basically use the the chaos and confusion and my plus one that I get for acting on the answer to this. Yeah, uh, yep. to save uh, people out from under the noses of the people who are not paying attention to the citizens they should be saving. Yeah, yeah, and I want that. I will like specifically. That's what he's looking for. Is like that's what it wants. To, he wants it to look like to all the people yeah, yeah. in the <laughs> who's giving out the points. Right. There's another one. So there's like I'm gonna say there's like three different civilians that are like in between these two teams fighting. Right. Um. And there's just like, like stuff flying around. Bioelastic <laughs> yeah, like, is like oh, making, oh. um, like these like yeah yeah the this yeah the duplicities are just like help me help me. And it's like <laughs> just like stuff flying around. Uh. And like I don't know. Fuego is probably like over there, and I don't know. Crippler and I don't, I don't know if we made this comparison or, before, but I've always imagined the duplicity clones to be like uh electricity guy in My Hero after he shocks someone, where he's like dumb. Oh <laughs> like, yeah, Whoa. yeah, that's <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, sure, <laughs> yeah, so yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, so, and I think they're also like fighting robots behind them as they're like trying mm -hmm. to trade blows. Um, and I think I'm gonna say, oh man, I'm gonna say reflection is like paralyzed on the ground from from Crippler's ability. Oh jeez. So you like as you like run in this building and see all of this, you like this is everything that's going on. It's just absolute chaos. All right, I got a plus four total. Here we go. Nice. Hey, hey, nice. what we'll a hit. surprise. Uh, okay, so uh, you get in. Let's just say you and Miss just like scoop these three up, like in between everybody. 
And uh, I think Ice Blade is like, he's like, hey, wait, but like, you know, uh, <laughs> you snooze, you lose, like, Ice Blade. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and uh, uh, Bioelastic tries to like make a plastic um, like construct in the way of the door so that you like can't escape. But I assume you just like blast through it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of what. Can, can someone Melted have hit me? From- can someone have hit me with some sort of energy? Is there anyone here who has energy blasts? Uh, no, I don't think so. Of any sort? Not energy blasts. So, so let's, let's say, let's say this, because I'm doing the savior thing, right? Like I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm grabbing duplicity clones and then I'm like being tossed, to- tossed around by the blast. Yeah. Too. I assumed, but yeah, I'm, I assumed but I'm like, like, you're getting hit by stuff. Yeah. And, and then yeah. we see my power armor go purple, 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 more mm-hmm. and more purple. And when yeah, he does yeah. the plasticity, I'm like, nice try, but, uh, <laughs> yeah, but no, kind of like I'm Iron Man to- hand. Uh, right, like exactly. I, I'm trying to think of the, the, of the right line, but but um, so I, I just look at him and I'm like, nice try, but uh, your friends there, uh, your your friends there gave me just what I needed to get past this, um, and then I oh, yeah, sure, just hold yeah. up hold up yeah. a hand and yeah. <laughs> giant purple blast, <laughs> um, and then me and Miss just walk out <laughs> calmly. Yeah, with yeah. Our, uh, I'm gonna I, say, I have like two duplicity clones on my shoulders. Yeah, 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 yeah. A couple there. Uh, I think as you're coming out, Flutter just delivered like six civilians, and I, it, mm-hmm. she like flies by you, and uh, she's gonna try and and like pull all of them up to her. Oh come on! I was nice yep. to her. Yeah, I, it's okay. So I'd like to do this. Oh, wait, as, and she comes, as, as she was flying by, yeah. before by the way, she was like cackling. She's like. Whoop! <laughs> so like so she's just like oh, what i want to do to head this off before it even happens is i want to as she's coming back i say nice job flutter you're doing a great job being a hero she's like thanks let me help you guys out too <laughs> <laughs> can i can i try to like you provoke, uh, her? provoke her oh to, sure to yeah. be, what i'm doing is basically provoking her to be like oh i'm gonna be a, such a jerk if i do this like because i'm like giving um, her a thumbs up i'm like oh you're doing such a great job flutter like i'm so proud of you yeah, so I think you, I think you s- try to do that, but provoking someone is someone susceptible to your words. Flutter don't care. Okay, all right. I think, I think she, I think she's just gonna try it. She just okay. So to, like, pull them then up. I would, I would put down the citizens, and uh, I'd be like, okay, Miss, you're in charge. Well, you of the, definitely like, keeping... put them down. She like pulls them up to her. No, no, no. What, I, what? This is what I say. I say, I say, Mist, um, keep them on the ground. As um, as uh, you're, you're in charge of making, of making sure that these are our wins. And I, I like let go of my citizens, but I, I am assuming that Miss like has some tendrils of water and <laughs> like tries to grab onto them. That, that would be my goal. And then I'm what I'm going to do is like distract Flutter and like attack her so that she can't steal our stuff. Uh, okay, let me. I'm going to say Flutter is pulling them in the air, and Mist becomes different tendrils and is like trying to yeah hold right. them or like shield them from the wind. But she's struggling because she doesn't want to break them. Right. Oh, right. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. 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 I, I'm just uh, asking Miss to try that, and then I yeah. will help her by attacking Flutter and breaking yeah, her yeah. concentration. Um. Uh, cool. All right. Go ahead so and roll I, uh, danger. I assume. Unfortunately, yes. I believe that's what I'm doing. <laughs> well, can you not pull your punches? And roll a savior. Yeah, you can do your, oh, you can do your team more, move or your more, uh, special I, move. I have more than a shield. When you directly engage a threat by heading directly into danger without regard for your... No, that's not what I'm doing. Um, I thought there was one you had where you could roll plus savior if you pull your punch. No, that's a legacy. Uh, never mind. Yeah, it's a different one. Oh, that's something um, that Bastion's uh, uh, used commit. as a... Oh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah. save There's two different ones that let you roll savior instead of danger, and I get them yep. mixed up a lot. Yep. Um, I could do game face when you commit yourself to save someone or defeat a terrible enemy. Does that count here? Uh, is she a terrible enemy? She seems kind of silly. But I was thinking, save our citizens, right? I suppose. Um, no, I don't think so. Because I guess she's think, also think, trying to save them. She's just yeah, trying to steal yeah. our she's, points. Flutter isn't a dangerous enemy as much as yeah. she wants to cackle and be the wicked witch of the west. Um. <laughs> um. Well, can Bu- I? Can I boy is the is the good witch. It comes down on a bubble. <laughs> <laughs> I, okay, can I can I frame this in such a way that I'm directly engaging a threat by heading directly into danger without regard for my own safety? Is there a way that I could get in the way of flutter that would like be dangerous to me, where I could do more than a shield? I don't think so. Um, not any more than just it would be for anybody, yeah. right? Like, I mean, just directly engaging a threat. I don't think it's any more dangerous than. Darn. 
I really need another move. <laughs> I need to get one more potential <laughs> so I can finally upgrade. <laughs> I'm running well, out of stuff I, I could do. The way the way for that to happen is to roll with moves that you don't aren't that's true. Uh, great at. That's, that's what I'm, fair. I'm trying to give you guys something that's, where it's, no, uh, it's you're a little right. bit more challenging as the face. Right. Uh, okay, so I'll I will just attack her. Yeah, I'll just directly engage a threat. Can I still get my plus one though? Because I'm still acting on the answer. You are. Yep. Okay. Well, here we go. Hey, it doesn't even matter. Yeah, you got a full hand no matter what. Good job. Um, Can't stop. Won't stop. Yep. Uh, okay, so when you directly gauge a threat, roll plus danger on a hit, trade blows on a 10 plus pick two. So you can resist or avoid their blows and take something from them. Yeah, I'll do that. Yep. Or or you could say impress, surprise, or frighten the opposition or create an opportunity for your allies. I think uh, as long as... Essentially, so, so, we're doing the same thing, honestly. Uh, yeah, yeah. My, my goal <laughs> narratively is to yeah. not take any damage from her. I, I don't yep. need conditions right now. And yep. to get the citizens at, to be our points. So what, what exactly do you do? Because so. Flutter's flying. So like, what exactly do you do to like I mean, you can fly. attack her? Yeah, I mean, um, you just like use a kinetic energy blast to like jump up at her. Yeah, and, like, grab I don't know if I have. Yeah, I, I, either that or just like I, I do have super strength and stuff from, you know, from uh, the just armor, the the power armor. I, I'm going to like yep. leap up to her and just engage her and like grapple her. Yeah. And, yeah keep her distracted um and i honestly i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna let mist have the full win i'm gonna i'm gonna distract sure. them like if i can get some points and that's fine but i i feel like it's gonna be better team leader stuff to just be like mist you get all these points and look at how many sure. points you're getting and flutter yep, gets yep. none right yeah yeah uh okay yeah uh so yeah i think i think uh um she's like cackling and uh, then you just like launch up at her and she's like, oh, <laughs> and and like uh, collide with her. And uh, um, she's like, hey, what? as you're like trying to pin yeah. her down or whatever. And I think you as you land, maybe you like uh, like come down in like an arm lock or something and allow Miss to Miss brings in the four uh, duplicates. And then do you just let her go? Like, what, um, what's kind of the resolution to that? I, I yeah until we score our score our, score all of our points and then I just like back off and uh, yeah, yeah, like I said, yeah am I in the air when this is happening? No, I I I, I described you coming down after. Oh okay, that. in a yeah. bubble. Yeah, no, I'm not in a bubble. <laughs> she came down in a bubble, bro. Uh, so yeah, yeah I, I basically just like I'm grappling her and then I let her go and I go. All right, well, game point for us. Yep. Uh, nice yeah, try, though. Flutter, Flutter. Fl yeah, Flutter's like. <sighs> Uh, and then just like, just like, I think she's like laying down on the ground, right? She's just like facing up and she just like slowly just like flies away, but like doesn't move her like position of like pouting <laughs> right. on laying down <laughs> and she like floats back away. She's like, sure. nice. um, and I think as, uh, uh, as, as that's happening here on me, I give Mist a, a water high five. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Um, let me pull you over here. Um, they're all there. Uh, as that's happening, I think uh, um, Laser Pointer like breaks out of the thing finally, uh, breaks out of the ice, and uh, like just was doing it like super slowly, and it's just like ha ha, I'm free, and turns around and looks at uh, you and Mist, and uh, I don't know, I don't know what he would do actually. Uh, I think I think he ignores you and looks over at uh, where Left Wing and Null and and uh, Quantum Quill are and stuff, and uh, I think. Uh, he he's gonna like run after them to try and try and help them out, uh, unless you want to stop him. But I assume you don't. Is, stop who? is your oh uh, oh laser, uh, laser pointer? He broke out of the ice, yep. right? Um, what is he? I'm just, just kind of wondering what your next goal team? is. He, he yeah, he's running to his team to protect them from left wing and quantum quill. Oh, uh, that'll stop him then. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah. So I'll, if he's he's starting to break out, how, at what point do I notice this and can get to him? Uh, right right as he's breaking out. Okay, um, I want to I want to do something that will have him point his laser at me and try to shoot me with it because I'm curious what will happen. <laughs> uh, I'm I'm gonna say Emoticon and Doomseer uh, are are running off to go more. Uh, yeah. Okay. Can I can I roll to provoke him? Um, I think I'm gonna the laser sure. pointer. I think I'm gonna yeah. be like, Hey, you, stay away from my teammates. And I I, I what I want him sure, to do yeah. is shoot his laser at me because I want to see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> that's a terrible idea i, I, I okay, know it um, is but I, yeah. I think that's what Palladium would want to do roll, roll provoke someone uh superior uh, 
Ooh, uh, barely okay. hit. So um, on a seven to nine, they can instead choose one. So you, they, he doesn't rise to the bait and do what you want. But on a seven okay. to nine, you can instead choose one. They stumble, you take plus one forward against them. They air, you gain a critical opportunity. They overreact, you gain influence over them. Um, either one of Maybe the first two. Long enough for you to punch him. <laughs> yeah, basically, I want to like if he's not going to shoot his laser at me, then I'll just close in on him and attack him. Right. Okay. Sure. So, uh, uh, so how does he? How does he actually? They react, stumble. Though? You take plus one forward against them. I think yeah. he he turns and and hesitates. I think he like he like points his finger at you and then he's like, wait, why did he? Why is he? Yeah, yeah. He's like, like well, he's, he's egging me he, on. Right. Yeah, yeah, he wants me to shoot him. Um, and uh, and then I'm gonna yeah try to try to use that opportunity to just close in the distance. Be so like, go ahead and like, roll directly engage a threat with a plus one bonus. Yeah, I, I think I say as I'm like rushing forward, I'm like I, I mutter to myself, "Well, it can't work every time, <laughs> <laughs> right?" Like let people yep. shoot at me and then give them their energy. Um, so I'm just gonna like I guess danger, like attack. Yeah. It. To- Yep, roll, roll danger with a plus one bonus because yep. you're you he stumbled yeah all right still uh seven to nine okay so you can choose one either resist or avoid their blows take something from them create an opportunity for your allies or impress surprise or frighten the opposition choose one so i do it so if i just trade blows and resist his blows all that happens is i hit him Yep. Um, how much damage would that do? Is that, is that, that's not going to take him out necessarily, right? Um, uh, why not? Yeah, why not? How about how about you you punch the room? I mean, you're a body armored guy. And right. He's, yeah, he's I can. Just a I can do a lot dude of that's not using his laser pointer because he doesn't know right. he's, he's stumbling. So yep. you, you catch him off guard. So I yeah, just I think sucker punch him across the jaw. Yeah, right? yeah. <laughs> but, so I think I think you you jump. Are you choosing to resist or avoid their blows? Yeah, I think so. If I can yeah, just take so him I out, think, then uh, I don't care about the other stuff. Yeah, I think I think before your uh, power armored arm reaches him. He goes, he goes, ah, and then disappears. <laughs> uh, uh, and out. I'm like, oh, man, that would have felt great. <laughs> right. Like that, that punch would have he been so died. satisfying. Yeah. Well, <laughs> yeah, he would, I mean, that is true. You, you almost, you, you would have killed a man, but okay. Okay. <laughs> would have felt great to kill a man. That's kind of what I, I think. I, 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 <laughs> that's not how he, that's not what Palladium was thinking. He was just uh, yeah, like, right, yeah. oh, like I was, he was waiting for the satisfying crack right. of like yeah, the yeah. punch. But he's, I'm just like, ah, oh, man. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, I think, I, I think mnemonic says, uh, looks like team, team one from, uh, um, uh, the, the, uh, DC school is taking out more of the other team's classmates. Not very classy of them. Uh, <laughs> He was going to go after my classmates. Come on. Yeah, I think you do that, right? You're like, you're like, well, yeah, <laughs> he's going after my classmates. And I think uh, I think duplicity is like, well, he he was trying to protect his own classmates. And there's like a little bit of like a, they're, they're like um, uh, a little bit because they attacked us in the first place. Right. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, so that's going on. All, <laughs> and we uh, see the they look at each other and the lightning bolt shoots between them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, let's cut over back to left wing and uh, um, null. I think Quantum Quill is like uh, um, shooting stuff at uh, uh, Blink and Bubble Boy. Uh, and Blink yeah. is just kind of like dancing around Come and Bubble off. Boy makes uh, like a bubble around himself. And all of Quantum Quill's attacks are just like bouncing off this like impenetrable bubble. I cannot Weird. hear the word bubble in this session without thinking about that meme now. <laughs> what I think, I think <laughs> so Blink funny. is trying to like make ice statues to like get statue out of the building. He's like, or, like dodging, hold things up trying and, like, to like hold things up yeah with like different ice statues funny. i um so what are, what are you doing left wing? You i had an idea to yeah. like tase this guy and like use him as a meat shield while she like pelted him with balls but then i was like but if he if he would die then he would leave and then i would get hit <laughs> so i'm not gonna do that plan anymore <laughs> yeah, uh, that would have been hilarious <laughs> if you had like not thought that through <laughs> yeah <right. laughs> i i was like yeah i would do that i'm like wait um and then, uh, yeah, so I guess I think we're just going hand in hand. Basically, yeah, yeah. this guy is strong and left wing's just trying to avoid his attacks. And then anytime he gets a chance, he's going to just because all he has to do is touch. Um, and I mean, if it's cool with you, can I have two of them or is it just the one? I don't, oh, you said, we said we were just going to do the one, right? We just said yeah, that earlier. Just one. Okay. So basically, anytime he gets a chance, he's just trying to like touch him or like he'll, he'll punch and like try and grab the back of his arm because uh, sure, all he has yeah. to do is touch. He doesn't actually have to get through his defenses at all. Yeah, for sure. Um, 
see, so yeah, I think we see him just kind of dancing around. He's just trying to get a get a grab on him. Um, uh, I assume that's directly engage a threat, unless you have a different argument. Yeah. Uh, no. Go ahead and roll plus danger. Unless does this guy just uh, does he um does he underestimate me? Uh, not in particular. Okay. I mean, you did electrocute him. Uh, yeah, but I cheated. Like we're in a, f- a fist fight, and he's built like the tank. So like. Um, I got the impression he felt like he was in control here. So I guess it that's doesn't what I'm necessarily asking. mean he's underestimating you. I mean, he can be confident, but not like overconfident. Sure. That's fine. Okay. It's only one difference, anyways. Uh, right. It wouldn't have made a difference anyway. Um, right. Okay. So on a seven to nine, pick one. Resist or avoid their blows. Take something from them. Create an opportunity for your allies or impress, surprise, or frighten the opposition. Well, I want to just not take blows and keep doing damage, but I also yeah. don't want to just be fighting him the whole time. Yeah, yeah. So, um, uh, well, d- 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 you could decide how you trade blows, right? I mean, you could electrocute him, and he could be out for the count. Right. Well, I guess I don't, you don't have to tell me this. I suppose that's, but like, if I do that, will he be down? Uh, and then we can move on to something else, or um, which is fine. If he's not, I'll just pick something different. I just, I would, I don't want to dwell too long on this. Yeah, unless yeah. You have, unless that, you have yeah, stuff you want to like. Thing. An exchange uh, yeah, you want to have? I, I was I was planning on him being down after this one. After, okay, then I'll just take avoid your blows, and um and and just not get hurt. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah, so, so I think so, uh, let let's say that you just shock him enough times. Yeah, I think that's what it looks like. I was like, you know, I'm, I'm basically egging him out. I'm like, come on, big boy, and then like out yeah, he'll miss, yeah. and I'll just like tap his shoulder and like zap yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. And then he'll come swing around and I'll like zap his ribs. And, and then, I think uh, I think at one point he like uh was shocked enough that he kind of like falls down to one knee. And then it gives yeah. you the opportunity to land. I think like I like a, I just like wrap myself around his back and like put yeah, my hand yeah. on his face. Yeah, like, yeah. Like straddle him basically, or like like not straddle him, but like hug him <laughs> and like like put my yeah, hand yeah. on his face and try yeah, and like yeah. like kind of like a headlock, but yeah. With your hand. Basically, on his I'm just face gonna tase and, him yeah. until they take him away. Now. <laughs> oh, um, but until you until they t- you take him they take him away. Well, I assume though, if they're like in the future, he's like, oh, he's going to be tased for ten straight seconds. They'd be like, okay. Uh, when I'm yeah, I suppose so. Um, Right? Uh, I was just going to say that he just like collapsed unconscious. Um, but yeah, I suppose oh. they would just take him away. So I think yeah. after a few seconds. Um, well, things assuming that they'll take him. So like if he's yeah, going to yeah. die, I'll stop. But like, Right, right. Yeah, no, <laughs> so I'll just I'll just say he, they take him away. All right, yeah. Cool. Uh, that was, yeah I, I don't, don't want to make a dark moment. We see it starts to spark and then he just. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Uh, yeah, he just takes all this. All right, who's next? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I think uh, I think they just get statue out, and uh, Quantum Coil yeah. is like left wing, a little help over here. And uh, I think yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, let me think about that. Um, I think Blink maybe like teleports behind um, uh, Quantum Quill and like puts her in a headlock, and then like teleports away. And there's just like an ice statue wrapped around her, and she like starts to fall because she's like in the air as she's like, oh, you're muted. Uh, I'll uh, I'll switch places with the statue then, so I'm holding her. Oh, okay, sure, yeah, good idea. And then I'll let go. I'd probably fall. <laughs> <laughs> well, go ahead and roll freak. Let's see, because that could be your oh, sure, yeah, uh, temporary or uh, unstable. Is you just, just fall get with to her. do things for free? Wow, <laughs> get hit uh, a lot of mid rolls in my plus threes here. So either mark a condition, or the GM will tell you how the effect is unstable or temporary. Um. Is it okay if I do unstable and temporary and I have to drop down? That was so like my, that was f- my idea. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. Um, she can fly away, but now I'm <laughs> surrounded by three of them. Oh, sure. Yeah. So she catches herself with the a ball bearings. Yeah. Um, but so basically like, I'm on her and then I like go. reaches for your hand. Yeah. She reaches yeah. for your hand to try and catch you uh and and doesn't get to you in time, and then you fall down and blink yeah. bubble boy and statue right there. And actually, I'm gonna say that bubble boy makes a bubble around you. Or no, because that wouldn't make sense. Because then you could just teleport out. I of could it. just teleport out of it. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I'm gonna <laughs> I mean, say he I'm might still do statue. it. But... I'm gonna say statue comes in and tries to uh, tries to punch you. Okay. Now nah, Bubble Boy's smarter than that. <laughs> okay. Um, Let's think of any way that they could actually hurt you. You just teleport um, away. They, nobody can trap you. I know. I love this that's, character. Yeah. That's so. That's so many. Which, so many abilities that these characters have is to trap yeah. people. When I love. It, the I think it was a really intelligent way they designed it. Like in some ways, I don't like it where they tell you what your powers have to be on the like you have to pick yeah. from the powers in the list. Right. But 
and they, they say, technically they say you don't have to they just know that these will work yeah and yeah. i think the the one where i see it works the best is this character all the powers are annoying yeah, yeah. Yeah, they they're are. all obnoxious. Sure. Yeah, they are. And I was like, yeah. it's so good. Yeah. <laughs> and like, no, it's it's perfect. It's perfect. Anyways, um, so uh, so statue comes in for like a a statue yeah. powered punch. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I can't go toe to toe with this guy. So, um, I mean, I guess what's the role? Like, I'm gonna try and avoid it, but like, um, I think I'm gonna have you roll just def- defend then. I think it'd be plus savior. Uh, well, okay. Also, I mean, so his his body turns to stone. Yep. His whole body is stone. It's just how how dense it is that changes. Correct. It, it, not always. He okay. can turn it off. Sure. So I can't tase him. I guess is what I'm saying. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. Okay. Well, yeah. Okay. I guess I'll just I'll just, I mean I'll just do the combat class thing, right? As soon as he tries to punch me, I'm gonna switch places with Bubble Boy. Right, because then I can uh, use free. Sure, I, I'm okay, not going to sure, protect. Yeah. I will yeah, yeah. not do well. Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, I, I think basically my in my mind this is I'm going to try and get these three people to fight each other. Yeah, yeah <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm just going to try yeah, and bounce yeah. around as much as I possibly can and try and fight all three of these guys. Because yeah. I'm right now I'm doing more effective work than I have at any point in the round. I'm I'm distracting three different people. Yep. <laughs> so I'm just going to do this as long as I can. Um, but I guess maybe can we have that be a thing? Like I wanted to just stay here. And do this dance as long as I can. Like I don't expect oh, well, that I'll how win. About, um, yeah, okay, so I, I want you to roll freak just to get out of yeah. this first punch here. But then afterwards, you should just roll the confuse skill to see if you. Um, oh, like see trick? if you can just hold them here. Yeah, just trick them into oh, sure. like fighting each other and and wasting their time. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. I guess it's but fine. roll freak can... first to see if you get out of this immediate danger. Okay. Uh. So that same team, man, I'm, I'm just really trying not to win. Okay, so seven to nine. <laughs> I mean, not uh, so that, either bad, mark but... a condition or the GM will tell you how the effect is unstable or temporary. Um, I mean, maybe that's, that's why I need to make the other roll, right? Like, I can only do this for so long, so I'm going to need to start, sure, like, yeah, resolving this, right? Like, yeah, they so, so uh, let's say you swap places with Bubble Boy and you're inside of Bubble Boy's bubble, right? And he just pops it, and yeah. uh, statue pulls his punch, though, and it's right. just like, oh. Oh, over here and and uh tries yeah. to uh punch you again and so you're like okay i can't just keep teleporting let me try something new yeah um i think and maybe maybe like statues below like you he, bubble boy pops the bubble right as statues punch is coming in so you're like yeah Ugh. yeah i think basically i'm gonna i'm gonna try and pretend that i can do it all the whole like just keep it up forever that's what, so i'm gonna switch places sure. with this guy you know yeah. and again it, i'm not to get him hit or anything i'm just gonna switch places yeah. like come on yeah. i can do this all day boys <laughs> yeah 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 and, and, and uh, I, I i'm think, gonna try and trick like, them into they're they're pretty good at this because they have sparred with someone who teleports as well so i'm gonna say minus one to this role that's true okay it's harder to trick these people mm-hmm. uh, so that's just no situation bonus there <laughs> holy cow oh my goodness Kapow. um okay oh, so uh well, you choose three right oh i'm oh right yeah i guess i'm so I, i'm assuming you're choosing wait. everything but avoid and further entanglement right right yeah sorry keep them there i as forgot the re- possible yeah i forgot there were choices here yeah um uh so yeah i'm gonna confuse them for some time right yep uh, I'm going to get an opportunity and I'm going to use that to try and like, get out of this. Okay. Um, if I expose a weakness or flaw, can I try and take one of them out? Expose a weakness or flaw. With this, like get them to punch each other. Well, I guess you said I, that doesn't seem reasonable because like you said, they can teleport and stuff. Um, um, just trying to think of what the other, like is either expose a weakness or flaw or avoid further entanglement. I guess I'll just do that. Um, Avoid further entanglement. Yeah, like I guess I don't know. I mean, entanglement's kind of the point of this. So, uh, you could. I mean, I potentially maybe. I don't know how well this works for blocking statue and bubble boy, but maybe blink just teleports so many times. There's so many ice statues that they're like it would be hard. <laughs> they're they're gonna have to like punch sure. their way out oh, of. Well, oh here, no, because bubble boy can just put them in a bubble and levitate over it. Never mind. Sure, I have an idea. I want to. The, the, like as a, maybe a combination of the opportunity and not being entangled further. I'm just replaced with a Moticon and they'll fight him. 
right? Ideally, I'm hoping oh, that they'll sure, fight him. Yeah. Like um, instead of say, switching with one of the three of them, I'm going to switch with the Moticon. He'll get punched, and then I'm hoping that'll turn into a brawl. And then I, so so I'm going to say they went off right, and and they come oh. back with with um uh, duplicates. Oh, with people duplicates. Okay, yeah. Yep. Yep. Okay, th- that's even better because then I'll be stuck yep. next to Doom Syrup. <laughs> exactly. Yep. Yep. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, and I'm going to say that the rest of their team, though, is with them, too. Uh, who, who would it be? It's uh, uh, Hunting Harmony, Pocket Arsenal, Shorty, and DJ. Uh, except Shorty is probably like. Um, oh, actually, uh, an important note about. So DJ, I think, is. Um, they're, they're all probably holding the phone. Uh, just one thing to note about. So they're, they're all coming back with um, duplicates and stuff. Oh my gosh, mm. dude. Pocket Arsenal is just going to open up his portal and just like dump <laughs> duplicates out. <laughs> uh, Can okay. they survive in there? Uh, no, I guess they don't have to. They, they would have to breathe. So right. maybe they can't. Yeah, so maybe he can't do that. So maybe he's just holding one. Yeah, that makes more sense. Never I was going to say, because like, maybe they would survive. Or he accidentally not killed, like, yeah. t- like oh, yeah, he, he, he opens it up. Pocket Arsenal like, has, like, negative man. 50 oh, points. Yes. no. <laughs> yeah, at least, <laughs> like, you, at least you figured it out now instead of in the field. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, no, so he, he would have tried that before in, in Rescue Class. Before, so <laughs> he killed yeah. someone? Oh, okay. He, well, no, like in the rescue, duplicates. Rescue class. Yeah, yeah, the yeah duplicates, rescue class. Yeah. yeah, that's too bad. Uh, I wanted him to have just like negative 100 points from keeping doing yeah, that, not realizing yeah. they were dying. So I'm going to say that like emoticon is like um, like leading the charge, though. So you'll you'll have some space between some people. OK, but Shorty, actually, uh, something new that you've noticed. Um, uh, he is like uh, half size and still carrying one of the. Uh, oh, he's maintaining his strength even though yeah he's yeah he's he's main yeah he's so he can actually still carry one that's something new nice. he's trying all right neat. um but he's like still super fast he's like dropping one off and then uh yeah he's zooming off probably to go get another yeah, one yeah and emoticon is carrying one on each shoulder um so you okay. can swap places and be holding two sick that's the opportunity you get all right thanks yes i will do that do you want me to roll i assume uh, well, no, that's because that's the opportunity, right? So I'm going to say you oh, okay. just do it. Oh, sick. Thanks. You, you, you compound yeah. that. I'm going to say that's one of the things <laughs> you get. Yeah. yeah so basically, yeah, like I could do this all day. We're going around with yeah. dice statues everywhere. And then uh, 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 a Emoticon uh, pops over there and statue like punches him in the gut. Yeah. And, and what happens uh, is like, is like I pretend to trip. And I'm like, oh, crap. And then he comes yeah, over yeah. me to punch. And then I switch places with Emoticon. Yeah. 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 Um, and uh, Emoticon's like, <sighs> Let's go. <laughs> Does he get hit? Uh, yeah, he gets hit. Okay. Yeah. All right, and then uh, um, actually, he, I, oh, I'm going to put it this way. I'm going to say that he he tries to like uh, put happy in to just like fly out of the way. But he's oh, so yeah. ticked off at you that that <laughs> Ager, he knows it's me, yeah. <laughs> takes precedence. And uh, um, uh, and he he just has to like fight them with ice. Oh, and uh, I, I think Juan and Quill just like pops over to where you are and is like, yeah. nice. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> um, Did you just run in with uh, the two duplicates? Yeah. And then I think I yelled there like, so you can grab one of those. <laughs> I like pointing at the other people. <laughs> oh, like, sure. Steal their, uh, steal their guys. <laughs> uh, yeah. I think Quantum Quill is like, sorry, DJ. And just like uh, gathers a bunch of the uh, bearing balls and just like He's lifts just, up like, du- their duplicity. And DJ's down. like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I think, I think this time DJ is like, ah, you had me last time quantum, but now I've got these cool little drones and quantum quill just like th- uh, pushes them into, um, into the building and like, just, that just like knock them? over. Yeah. They're, they're both <laughs> below 10 pounds. And uh, quantum <laughs> goes like, <laughs> DJ, when will you learn your place? And just like gathers two plus Dang. <laughs> roasted. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's so um, funny. Because because uh, the they're, the only interaction they've ever had was quantum quote just like decimating DJ, yeah, just wrecking him instantly. Um, yeah. yeah, so that's great. That's their history. So I think you guys both bring them yeah. into cool. and, and you guys score some points. So let me cut it back over to yep. uh, Bastion and Thunder. Um, uh what what have you guys been doing in the meantime here so you did de- completely demolish this giant thing what what have you guys been doing do you maybe like go into one of these buildings and are trying to rescue some civilians or uh, fight some combatants or sorry i i have to switch to my uh my headset i'm changing a pp oh, oh okay yep sorry <laughs> I, yeah the nachos were too much this morning <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm joking, I have a child. 
<laughs> um, I mean, really good. I, I guess I guess the question is, what are you trying to prioritize? Are you trying to get back to the group, find combatants, or I think I want to assess the situation. Okay, like just nice. get a feeling on like how much points are left to gain. Whether like what would be the most tactical thing to go for? Yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe who is most vulnerable to me is is uh, or what can, can I use to gain the most points? Would probably be the most yeah accurate one. So go ahead and roll plus superior, can or you... I can roll for you if you yep. yeah. I think I have plus two to that. Yep. Nice. Uh, nice. Okay, so you got a nine. Uh, there is no team left, so you kind of have to stick with the nine. I think. Yeah, that's fine. Um. On uh, a seven to nine, ask once and take plus one and we'll act in the answers. So what here can I use to gain the most points, I assume, is what you want to. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think um, I'm going to say there's like uh, several large enemies, not the humongous ones, but like the 10 point ones. There's like mm-hmm. several large enemies in this building here. Well, I mean, we're already on a destruction spree. You may as well take out the yep. next biggest ones. Yep. Uh, nice. So. Uh, what 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 does that look like? I think a thunder probably comes in the door. Maybe you like come down from the top floor, and mm-hmm. uh, um, or, or I guess you could just carry her up too. So maybe you guys are just yeah. together. Um, are you guys maybe just maybe going down in the like building? Take turns. Go like I'll, yeah. I'll destroy one. She destroys one. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So go ahead and roll danger, and let's let's see how that uh, right. plays out. I'm gonna attack very recklessly. Oh, okay. All right. Try and catch uh, up to be fa- as fast as Then you'll as probably can. lose points. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, you, that would be, are you saying well, recklessly no, no, as no, in like for, putting for yourself my, in For danger? my life, not for... Okay, yeah, because that's oh. what the roll is, right? Yeah. Save your roll or whatever. So I'll be rolling um, uh, defend instead of... Yep. And and go ahead and take that plus one situational bonus for you're, you're uh, gonna have to roll acting for on the answers. Again. Oh, yeah, that's right. Sorry. So three um, plus one. Yep, yep. That's, Your a, that's a four three. again. Yeah, his saber is a three. Disgusting. All right, so full hit. So um, on, on a hit, trade blows. So uh, on a 10 plus, pick two. Resist um, or avoid their blows, which I assume yeah. you're going to pick. Take something from them, which would be points. I mean, you're getting uh, that automatically, right? Yeah, you're already getting I'm not sure what that would mean. Create an yeah. opportunity for your allies. You could say that Thunder gets a lot of points, too, maybe with that one. Um, and then impress, surprise, or frighten the opposition. Uh, I don't really know what that would mean either. I, I guess you could a, an extra an extra gold noodle star. Uh, no, I don't think so. Okay, not with that one. Uh, uh, there, I, you, I guess you could say the that there hid, are other the hidden teammates. point. Would the impress surprise or whatever that is there a secret point factor? Uh, let me think about involved that. in that one. You don't want to get under the points. Well, I got her. The, I got her the the biggest point sign. Yeah. <laughs> true, true. Um, let me think about that. And I'm already giving her half the kills, so. Yeah. yeah. Press surprise or frighten the opposition. Yeah. Baby, stop fighting. Um. <laughs> uh. Um. Yeah, I think so. I think I think uh, there's there's a particular situation where Thunder is like s- surrounded by. Um, mm-hmm. some of the large robots and she's like trying not to damage the property so she's struggling mm-hmm. to mm-hmm. Um, protect herself and and you sweep in and, and destroy them and uh that i think that that gets you some some secret bonus points okay yeah i'll do those two then um okay so i think as you clear the room you kind of get down to the bottom of uh or like the bottom floor you've like cleared the building of all these uh robots um and i think as you do the buzzer sounds nice. and the phase is over um hey i got 30 points i win right <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh no you don't so i think i think uh, let, me, let me pull up the uh um i made like a, a thing i don't i can't like move them easily though so let me think of okay so uh oh dang i should have made like a tier list so i could actually like drag and drop them conveniently but uh, uh, so Palladium and Mist, I think um, I think you I think Pal- I actually I think Mist is the first. Yeah, uh, she rescued a lot of people because she is able to um, mm-hmm. uh, carry more people than yeah, Palladium. Her powers was. are very yeah. good at that. 
Um, I think Palladium is second. Nice. Um, I'm going to say Green Tiger is third. Dang. Um, let me As think. a note, we don't need to rank everyone, just the top whatever. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, I'm trying to think of... Um, does Bastion get... I think... I think Bastion gets four. Well, I don't know. Thunder would probably score more than Bastion because of the... I just don't know what the hidden points are that you're... Oh, that's true. That you're measuring. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think... Well, it might be Thunder. So, so uh, it'd be the difference between... Well, Thunder had the negative points, points that... at the beginning. To yeah, that, true. Yep. That she didn't remake, but I did make up those points. Um, yeah, I suppose, I suppose we should say that, uh, Bastion is, is, uh, is fourth, um, just in terms of combat, uh, points and you guys took out like this whole building. Um, and, uh, so, okay, let, let me, let me, so the buzzer sounds, um, and I think everybody just like poofs to where, um, uh, what's his name is, uh, oh, yeah, Beacon. Yeah. everybody kind of just like poofs back into, um, the like, uh, waiting area. And uh, maybe maybe the waiting area is kind of like in one of these box areas too, so you guys can actually see uh, the arena as yeah, well. Yeah. Um, and uh, I think Duplicity and 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 all of them start announcing like, and that's the end of the phase. Uh, let's see who landed in the top four places. Um, and uh, they're da, like, da, da, oh. da, da, da. so wh- yeah. how much are the secret points for taking out people? Because I know I won. Mm -hmm. (laughs) uh yeah i think maybe like the other teachers are in the room with you yeah Yeah, let's say let's say they're you guys are all in the same box area so like the announcers are kind of like in their own little box yeah uh but you guys can kind of see them and uh you say that and weightless grunts uh like you have no (laughs) idea what you're talking about and um uh uh duplicity says and we also are going to award some secret points for heroism Oh. <laughs> uh palladium <laughs> scores some points for heroism landing him in the second spot right above green tiger and right below mist i had a Bastion feeling that was also get some hero uh, uh, uh heroism points um for uh uh protecting his teammate and uh for protecting thunder and using his combat abilities uh, or using using teamwork to promote the uh safety well-being and success of his teammate do I get um, so any I for think, c- catching uh catching flutter and fighting three people? Catching flutter? Oh no, sorry, not flutter. Um uh wow. The girl who throws things. What quantum? Quantum quill. Oh, catching her? Oh uh, no, I don't yeah. think so. I think um I, I fought I think, three people at once so she wouldn't get hurt. Yeah, I think I think <laughs> I think they specifically just like and, and this is judged not by like um what's it called? Like uh like you did X, so you get you know, uh, X amount sure, of points. It's, 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 it's more yeah. like uh, it's more just a special reward based. for the specific people who yeah, stood over, out o- in here over the course of the phase. So, yeah, so it's like different points of the, the, the good deed. Ex- exactly. So you act like a villain I wasn't for most being of the heroic. phase. All yeah, I did exactly. was steal people's stuff. Come on. Yeah. No, even it's, even you while you were saving quantum the most will, heroic. it was. Yeah, I'm not kidding. Yeah, I'm being facetious. Yeah, it's fine. I get you. And I'm sure left wing is also like angry about it. Like I didn't realize there was a points. Yeah, it sounded like it was for a specific thing, so that's why I was uh, suggesting it. But if it right, was an yeah, overall yeah. thing, I definitely didn't <laughs> get it. Yeah. Um, so right. I, I so uh, I think Bastion does earn earn the fourth spot. I'm just nervous nice. about having two players on the same team and have one player on a on uh, not on the same. That's team. all right. Uh, that'll but that'll be, okay. be fine. That'll, that'll be, be fun. for which is one phase. Yeah, I figured it, <laughs> would, it classic, would be fun to do that too. It's a classic yeah. David thing. David's the antagonist to all of us. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> wait what i, I do tend to what? play oh you're being facetious okay <laughs> he's played antagonistic characters yeah oh does he oh yeah. wait you weren't being sarcastic yeah no, no i'm pretty much always Dylan, like, remember i had caspian I had, yeah. oh i suppose that's true yeah yeah uh, in okay. the star wars one yeah the the Rock, that's definitely movie. true yeah oh um, definitely okay yeah, no, yeah. I like a little inner party conflict that I'm always in the Hellbreaker yeah. sequence. He was like playing yeah, the yeah. big bad. Evil I literally faction. played the bad guys. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. I didn't think about that. Okay. Um, yep. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, so I'll give that fourth spot to Bastion. So Thunder is still up there, um, which does affect the um, 
the team placement. So Thunder will be with uh, lower scoring people to like balance out teams. But the first team is meant to be like the top of the top, the best of the best. Mm -hmm. Um, So I'll maybe give Thunder uh, spot five. Uh, left wing, you're probably towards like the bottom twenty, or like. <laughs> Am I going to get stuck 20? with bubble because like, maybe... we both scored so few points? <laughs> uh, yeah, I think you do actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's hilarious. do that. No. Let's gonna say I'm gonna say for the for the next get... team, we'll go left wing. It's just gonna be uh, everybody I kill because none of them got to score points. Yeah, well, no, it, <laughs> that would be it, hilarious. <laughs> well, no, because because uh, um, you don't score a lot of points, so I think you are stuck with bubble gum though. But you barely got any points. Right, that's um, what I mean. And neither did any of the people I killed. I think Thunder is also probably going to be on your team, though, because it's balanced. They they take like some of the high scores oh, and I put see. them with some of the low it's scores. A, it's a balance. They're great, they're great on a curve. Yes, oh, no. yes. Thank goodness. Um, <laughs> we're so, we're well, we're not great on a curve. Team. It's 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 that the teams are assigned um, from each rank. Try to be balanced. Right? Yeah. yeah. To balance Basically, with, we're building a yeah. war game army. I'm worth five points, and everyone yeah. else is exactly. worth forty. Exactly. Yeah, and so they're yeah, like, yeah. we got to fit this five point character uh, here somewhere. Exactly. <laughs> that's how that's how it works. Exactly. Um, okay. I'm gonna say I mean, maybe I'll think about this because. You make sure I, and you can also decide this for next parents. time, right? I mean, I want well, my teams to be Bubblegum, Doomseer, and uh, uh, I don't know who else. or Blink. Annoying. Yeah, sure, that sounds good. <laughs> and Adamotic yeah, he's the only one that would be funny that I don't want to be on his team. <laughs> or was he too busy being angry? Who? What? Sorry. Who? Did oh yeah, how well did he score? A lot, or did, was he too busy being angry? Emoticon. <laughs> Oh, emoticon. I think emoticon is in top 10, but not quite. Um, he's probably like number 10. Um, quantum quill is, it was low. Like you were, um, I'm trying to think, I think flutter probably also got a ton of points. So maybe I'm going to put left wing bubblegum flutter and hmm, who else? Doomseer. <laughs> Doomseer seems like a big, a mid mid tier character. Yeah, probably. That'd um, be hilarious. I, well, I'm not sure if I want to. I mean, uh, I don't know how she could have scored points because she can't. You can't break the robots with your hands. She's not like super strong. She's just good she, at fighting. I assume she saved people. Yeah, right. she's probably pretty low, actually. But she probably only rescued two or three civilians. Okay. Yeah, because we didn't see any of them come through. That's and true. again, I know yeah. we didn't see everybody come through, but like, yeah. So Shorty um, probably did pretty good. He probably was. Just, yeah, I probably didn't even see him turning his people. <laughs> um. So I got one, one low, one high. So let me think one more mid tier. Um, might make sense. Oh, I guess we're doing top tens, right? Is that what you're looking for? No, I already got one oh. from top ten. Flutter was top ten. Okay. Are, are you we're trying to assemble my team low. right now? Yeah. Okay. Probably. Were, I mean, nobody low, in the so team I was fighting scored points. Exactly. So that's like, right. I'm trying to. I'm just thinking yeah. of the most interesting because I. Oh sure. Um, sure. I'm, lo- I'm finding someone from like the tens. Oh, okay. Um, what are the options? Uh, Alchemist, Ice Blade, um, Haunting Harmony, but she's more low. You should do Haunting Harmony because she's uh, terrifying to left wing. So uh, <laughs> that would be funny. That would be funny. Yeah, um, we can do that. Okay. Uh, Haunting Harmony. So you'll be with a lot of people from your group, and then plus Bubblegum. So we'll Great. do we'll do that team, and then I'll I'll make I'll make teams uh, for the other people at a different yeah. time. But oh, I guess I, that's get a thought. I guess we could have team. had newer people in, if you want. Uh, well, that's that's what I was looking for, but I wasn't sure what yeah. the most interesting person would be. And there's two more phases after this, so um, true, true. I, I I I think this this get up will be interesting. I I'm curious to see how left wing is going to try and plan around these people. I don't even remember this, what we're uh, doing in the second one. Hey, uh, so, so let's let's just get a locker room scene. So, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. you guys, uh, give me one minute here. Uh, go go ahead and uh, let's start with the locker room scene. So, you guys are uh, yeah. like, we'll cut to you guys walking in, and go ahead. I'll, I'll be able to listen in, but not. Uh, I hope you guys scored a lot of points. I mean, I know you did uh, because I scored nothing getting you there. So, you're welcome. <laughs> Uh, but also Thunder destroyed an entire machine. That's insane. Uh, good job, Ashton. Keeping her alive. Good job, Palladium. Good, good job me. on her not destroying me. <laughs> yeah, fair. Yeah, yeah you know, fine. she's a lot more terrifying than I realized. Um, yeah. <laughs> All right, is, this the, is this the after yeah, powwow? Is that, is that what we're yeah. doing? Okay. 
Yeah. <laughs> Actually, you know, there are there are team moves. Like I know mine is when you when you share a triumphant celebration with somebody, ask them if they think you're cool. If they say yes, give them influence, take influence over them. If they say no, mark a condition. I mean, I don't want any of those things to happen. Oh, then either way, add a team to the pool, but I don't want any of that stuff. So, um, uh, kind of stand on the oh, scenario yeah. so we, we get team refreshed. Anyway. Right. Yeah, exactly. But some of you might have one that would work. Um, Share a triumphant celebration with someone. Ask them if they see you as the person wearing the mask or the person underneath. If the former, mark potential and clear a condition. If the latter, take influence over them if you reveal yourself. Interesting. Where do you find that? Uh, on your character sheet, just in the middle at the bottom. Team I didn't realize teams. we had separate ones. Yeah, it's it's based on your your class, uh, your playbook. They're all different. Hmm. Yeah, I, I might do this with Mist. <clears throat> oh yeah. A- ask that. Ask them if they see you as the person wearing the mask or the person mm-hmm. underneath. Right. I don't know how I would bring that up, but. Yeah, that's a good point. Uh, Connor has an idea. Where did Connor go? Uh, he had to step away for a second, so that's why he's okay. doing this. So we're just talking with each other. Okay. I have two team moves. Oh, yes. I'm back. What was your question, Caleb? You're asking yeah, how that two team moves, skill yeah. works oh. for your well, yeah, we have the, the team moves. I um, David brought oh, up team moves. that we have team moves yeah. that we each have individual ones. Um, and the oh, the triggers yeah. are the same when you share a triumphant celebration with someone or when you share a vul- vulnerability or weakness with someone yeah, yeah um, the effects are different. technically me and mist got top places i could share yeah, a triumphant yeah. celebration with her and then yeah, ask them sure. if they see you as the person wearing the mask or the person underneath sure um i don't know how i would bring that up but i do think it's an interesting idea do you have an yeah. idea um uh, well, so you guys put, per, so maybe you guys are like like walking to like that locker room area we were talking yeah. about before um it's probably just like attached to this this box here so you guys can like walk out of the locker room and see what's going on in the field um uh let's say or oh yeah so, so it'd be like here probably so you guys can maybe there's like two boxes like an announcer box and like a viewing box and that's where all the teachers and and then the locker rooms are attached to that um, just for simplicity's sake. So you guys were teleported there. So then maybe um, they announce the winners, right? Duplicy is like, Mist is in first place, followed by Palladium. Yeah, high five. I go to give Mist a high five. And then Palladium. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. And uh, Mist is like, we did it. We nailed it. We Out of 36 people, we were the top two. Yeah, and I do that kind of like a, I poke her in the water you know, collarbone, whatever, you know, like it, it's obviously not really uh, anything, but Solid. I just like poker yeah. in the water. And, and I say, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, what else am I to say? She doesn't have limbs. <laughs> oh, limbs. I poke her in the arm of her okay. water, right? Yeah, yeah. Why? <laughs> <clears throat> well, you, you, you gotta have, have to say something. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, I. Yeah, so I, because the, 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 I I'm not, I've literally forgotten what I was going to say, but oh, it's no. taken so long to, <laughs> to do this. But it was like, you know, we, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I, I poke her in the arm and I say, it's because we were focused on being heroes, on saving people. Well, the rest of these clowns, no offense. Yeah, you're, you're welcome for that, by the way. Because, <laughs> yeah. uh, you know, I killed everybody. So yeah, you're I welcome. Think, I think Miss yeah, kind of that- chuckles and, and, and like, um, like comes to you left wing and is like, it's like, thank you for your help. This victory yeah, you bet, you bet. is is team one's victory. I nod. Yeah, yeah I, I'll, I, be, I say- I'll be third place. Watch. <laughs> <laughs> and Tiger. <laughs> yeah. Right, yeah. 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 Rude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, but I basically say, I say like, each of these, uh, each of these rounds, rounds. What are what would be another name for the phase? The phase. But yeah, each, each of these phases phase. are going to have their own challenges, and we had to focus on what really mattered uh, in this phase, and that was saving people. And I, I, you know, it's maybe a humble brag, but I feel like you and I are pretty good at that. And I, dude, yeah, knucks, yeah. <laughs> right? Um. Uh, okay. So what is what? So um. You're, I'm trying to pull up that role then. So you're you're sharing a a, 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 a victory, right? So what is the when, ask them if they uh, see you as the person wearing the mask or the person underneath? I don't really know how to bring that up though. Uh, yeah, I don't. Like know. we, me and Miss are the people who would have the most triumphant celebration together. Yeah. Probably. Mm-hmm. I, I, but I'm curious how I would go about doing that because I'd like. 
Um, I guess I take Maybe off my helmet like... since we're behind closed doors, right? Um, are we? Okay. Are we not? I uh, um. We're in a locker room, right? So. Yeah, yeah, you, Although, yeah. Although I don't no, know why we'd be in no the same civilians, locker room. No civilians, no civilians could see you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, but go ahead. Yeah. Uh, so you take okay. off the, mask. the way you reacted yeah. to that, though. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. No, go ahead. keep going. Um. Uh, um. <laughs> Uh, I guess I keep. I just. The keep, I always have stuff going on. I guess I keep the helmet on then. Um, that makes. I, I've already described Palladium as like being paranoid about that for the yeah, tournament. Yeah, so yeah. I'll, I'll say he keeps it on. Okay. So <clears throat> I'm saying this right, and um, I guess I say maybe you could like wish that your girlfriend could know that it was you, and then that can bring up your other side, right? Like. Yeah, yeah. So I'm. I, I like turn. And I'm looking at the TV or whatever that they have in the locker room that's like showing the the scores and stuff, right? And and I, I, I am silent for a moment, and I'm like. I I guess I just wish that I don't know the people that we actually are could be up there. Like I mean, everyone knows Palladium, I guess now, but um, really, uh, and I turn back. Really, it's about who you are inside. You know, like it's about mm-hmm. your heart, and I feel like our hearts were in the right place. No offense, Leftwing. <laughs> And I said that mostly hey, this funny, is your not plan, bro. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I chuckle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. I, I guess I guess she says. Um. Well, I guess I don't really. Um. I don't know how would she respond to this. Um. Because like you have to basically choose between who who she sees me as based on that. Yeah. Does she affirm my mask or my? my real life um i think she affirms your mask i think i think she says um i think she says uh uh, well yeah but um but what we're showing the nation here is is how much of a hero you are and that's definitely what you demonstrated and that's what the people that's the, the whole point of this is that's what we want the people to see is who the heroes are what the future looks like yeah i nod you're right. And I mark a potential. I yeah. finally <laughs> upgrade. There you go. Oh, nice. Awesome. Oh, hey, yeah, there you go. Yeah, you I go. finally get a stupid advancement. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Missed. It's literally been like <laughs> six sessions since I did that. Yep. Jeez. <laughs> and then they announced Bastion's my, fourth, right? Got to look at my Palladium plane. Uh, yep, they announced Bastion's fourth. Yep. Yeah, yeah Bastion. Uh, due to hero points. And uh, I think Thunder goes to you and is like, oops. I think Thunder uh, uh, comes up to you, Bastien, and is like, uh, thank you. I mean, it, it sounds like uh, I scored just a little bit more combat points than you, uh, and and you beat me with your heroism points, which I totally agree with. I mean, if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have even destroyed that that big one. I, I just gave you a push. Um, she says, <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Pun. It's a pun. Yeah, she kind of, she kind of, <laughs> uh, uh, not pity laughs, but like, um, like that was cute. awkwardly. Yeah, no, like, like <laughs> yeah. that. Oh, that's that a cute thing you just said. Um, and and um, says thank you. I really appreciate it. A push is what I needed. I mean, we all need to push sometimes. You quite literally pushed me off of a, <laughs> a high place. Um, I think I think she nods and says, "Well, I guess go over to your new team. I'll see you out there on the field. I promise not to go. I mean, I won't go super easy on you, but I promise not to go too hard on you either. I, I promise you'll, not you'll to have to, you have to bring that out. You have to bring out that move again to to, to bring me down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's like there's a bead of sweat." <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, and i think uh um beacon is going around like touching everybody on the shoulder and like uh planting more beacons oh yeah um and then as as uh um uh you guys are, are looking kind of over the the city uh in like the box you guys start to hear something funny um like like a um i don't even know if it would be a yeah i think you guys kind of start to hear maybe a little bit of like this weird like sand moving crumbling sound and the whole city just kind of like evaporates into like these like glowing like uh, particles, um, and uh, just kind of like come back into like our, um, 
uh, well, I don't know if they would come back to him. Uh, no, I don't think they do. I think it just, I think it just like disintegrates into these like weird, like light blue, like white particle things. Um, and, uh, uh, you notice that architect is no longer in the like, uh, um, uh, box mm -hmm. and he like comes back down to the, uh, like floor of where the phase was and, uh, puts his hand down on, onto the ground and, uh, creates a new phase, Dang. um, for the tournament. Uh, and, uh, um, I think mnemonic uh says um like over the speaker i think duplicity and angel are like holy crap and mnemonic is like um uh and what you're seeing before you now is due to architect's uh uh power he can temporarily create uh massive structures and um uh, uh buildings um and we are utilizing his power for the tournament uh, phases to create unique um unique environments for uh our uh contestants to compete in pretty tight and uh we we just create he just creates an entirely new uh phase which uh i do have an image for but i'll, I'll review that to you guys after um i'll 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 because we don't have it up on the screen yet so i'll I'll, yeah. I'll send that to you guys and you guys can see it uh in like the after show or something maybe but uh he like cre is creating a new phase um uh in pre preparation for the next one uh but before we get to that i do want emoticon to come over to you left wing uh yeah yeah I, i'm uh, expecting I, a couple a couple uh <laughs> saucy letters in the mail yeah, yeah i think i think doomseer is like trying to stop him from coming over um and it's like oh, okay cool i thought she was gonna be one of them sorry yeah no she's like just just let it go emoticon and you like hear that and like turn from behind you and uh yeah. emoticon like steps up to you and i think kind of like the room just kind of like is like uh like watching a little bit um and like what place is he in um uh i don't know maybe like uh maybe like 15 to 12 ish okay not quite oh you said he was 10th right like 10th or 11th maybe i did I think yeah, he did, yeah, asked about yeah, yeah. So let's let's say he's tenth. Say, uh, I'll just write that down. Moticon tenth. Or right damn, like oh, just by the skinnier teeth, huh, buddy? Wow, yeah. Um, um, I think uh, I think he like whispers so that no one else can can hear. Yeah. Um, and there's like other people talking, but other people watching too. Like they can feel the tension in the room. Yeah. But he's trying to whisper something to you, and he says, sure. um, he says. You better watch your back, left wing. We're coming after you this whole tournament. You and me, we got a score to settle. And you you've never, you've never heard like real emotion in his voice before. Yeah. And uh, uh, obviously, anger is in his chest. And and yeah. uh, um, see, yeah, left wing taps his cheek. It's like you bet, buddy. <laughs> yeah, he says, um, um, you know what else? Um, or no, I don't know if um. Um. Yeah, yeah, I don't think he says I, anything else. Yeah, can I, I try and I think, provoke I him with that? Uh, sure. I want to yeah. try and get him to fight me and then get thrown out. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, let me think about that. I don't know if. Like I'm basically just trying to make him so mad he'll throw a punch without thinking. Uh, yeah, I I think he, I think he's is susceptible to your words enough to do that. Um okay. I don't think he's gonna get thrown out for it though, but he would get a demerit is probably what's gonna happen if he Oh if well, he I mean I like demerits. That's not good enough. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, he's definitely I, not gonna get thrown out. Okay. Yeah, because I assumed I'd probably have to take a condition, so that's not really worth it. But I'll just I'll just make him mad then. That's fine. Okay. Um why would you have to take a condition? Uh, I was I mean it, and he oh, probably, if, he, if he does actually punch, hit me mean? for it to work right like, uh yeah oh i assumed I i'd have mean. to get hit uh which i guess doesn't have to inflict the condition technically yeah, like, it doesn't narratively. To, but, yeah. But it, it, there's a good argument for inflicting angry or you know what i mean right except for that I was mean, the point where i was trying to get yeah. him to do it yeah but yeah yeah um but anyways uh, yeah it's, it's I, up to you i'll leave it alone yeah i'll leave okay. it alone uh yeah i think uh maybe maybe doomseer comes over and like pull, pulls out his arm and it's like just let it go emoticon and um can i can i sorry can i just like assess the situation I, basically i want to try and get a I, bonus against him i i want you to pierce the mask i oh. i there's something there's something going on here 
Um, yeah, I, I want you to roll pierce the mask. This is one okay. of the things I'm going to tell you to. Not ask when I fail, to. is something bad going to happen? <laughs> um, by definition, if you do fail, yeah. But the, but uh, there's there's it. something to. All right, fine. Wow, what? There you I had go. A minus Dude, two to that. Almost box cars. I had a minus um, two. <laughs> let me. Uh, when you pierce someone's mask to see the person beneath real pulps and Dane, on a seven to nine, ask one. What are you really planning? What do you want me to do? What do you intend to do? How could I get your character to blank? How could I gain influence over you? Oh, I guess these questions aren't necessarily what I was going to. I mean, uh, say, well, it, would assess the situation make more sense then for the question you want? No. I mean, you can just tell me what you want to tell me. It's fine. Um, uh, I'm trying to think of this. There's no reason to let the specific things get in the way. Yeah, I think I think you just I think you notice that um, he's he's definitely more angry than you thought he would be. And I, I think the thought comes to your mind that maybe he did ask Countess. Yeah, I had a feeling that was what uh, yeah. it was going to be about. Um, I, I was trying to get you to a position where you could figure that out or ask that question if you want. Yeah, to. I guess. Uh, so, okay, I guess what, what did he do? I said, yeah, I tapped on face. Did you bet, buddy? And then um, I think I think uh, um, he's just seething and do, a doomseer yeah. came over and was like tugging on his arm and he like pulls his yeah. arm free of doomseer. OK. Um, how long has it been since we had that conversation? Uh, a few weeks, I think, because there was like a okay. training montage. We it, an, 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 an undisclosed amount of time, a hand wave sure. amount of time sure. of a training. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah. So, yeah, I think he uh, and I mean, again, he's he's trying to rile him up. Because yep. he knows that he loses power. Like, he, you know, he can't yeah. be as good if he can't control his emotions. Yeah. So um, I think almost as much out of that as, as expecting that he actually knows. He's, he's just going to be like, did you, uh, did you ever talk to Countess, by the way? Um, uh, yeah, I think, I think and he, he, he kind of darkens. Um, yeah. And I think um, like a, a twinge of like, uh, I think you see sad kind of like mm-hmm. pull. It has like a pull to it and like a little bit of like a, a like a, 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 what's the word? Like a, I want to say like an electric bolt, but what's the word? Like it tingles, mm, like it's sure. being pulled. Um, as as you say that, right. um, and he and he says, um, um, yeah, and that's another thing. Thanks to you, Countess isn't training me anymore. So you and me, we got quite the score to settle. So and whatever you were what holding you over her head is gone, huh? Sorry, but. Yeah. Uh, no, you, you can say that. Maybe you talk over yeah. each other. He's like, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Probably. He's like, I never had anything over her. If that was true, she'd still be training you, but you don't got to tell me what it is. That's all right. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> I did he my says, job. Yeah. He, he says, um, um, and when, when I beat you in this tournament, she'll see that she chose wrong. Good luck with that, bud. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah boy this is so good <laughs> um okay so uh uh a two cliffhanger um you guys are hanging out uh you guys are getting into your groups of who's going to be in your team or whatever so it's bastion uh palladium mist green tiger and then left wing you're with bubblegum flutter hunting harmony um what we to cliffhanger um uh, marty uh walks into the room and uh he he comes over to you palladium and he's like hey P- palladium act cool okay don't don't take off your helmet or anything and uh, uh turns around and don't uh, i always sister, act cool marty your your sister walks into the room oh. with like a vip pass oh <laughs> and uh and she's like she's like wow this is so cool marty's like hey welcome yeah come on in let me show you backstage uh, we, uh and she, she like goes over it and like is like hey look this is uh oh yeah uh, we we yeah. see and, uh, uh like palladium stiffen <laughs> Yeah, yeah Palladium yeah. stiffens when she walks in. Do, I, do I see her there? Yeah, yeah. Do I, I know her, right? Right? Do I know her? Uh, I don't remember why you would know her. You're muted, Connor. I see you saying things. Well, because I know you in real I think life. I talking like to someone. Oh. Oh, yeah, uh, you knew me in real life. I don't know if you ever met my sister, though. Like, she didn't uh, go to no, the I'm same pretty school. sure you got... Oh, yeah, they didn't? Oh, she's probably she's probably too young. She's younger, yeah. Okay, all right. Okay, yeah. I was going to say, I'm totally. If I knew this was your sister, I was yeah. totally going to make it as awkward as possible. <laughs> all right, uh, but I guess I don't. So, yeah. Well, I like. I guess it's it's possible that you know my sister, but like, it's also equally as possible that you don't. It's more likely I know her name and that I wouldn't recognize her face, and that doesn't. Yes. Help, so yeah. Yes. Agreed. 
Um, Sorry, yeah, and um, uh, uh, Palladium, you uh, uh, realize um, with mm-hmm. uh, uh, panic that you received a bunch of missed calls and uh, texts when, uh, like, during your like preparation for the tournament, yeah. and uh, they're like all from your sister being like, "Hey, I'm gonna go to the uh, the tournament. Do you want to come with?" And like, like voicemails and stuff. Like, "Hey, we should oh, totally no. sit together at the tournament." <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> and obviously uh, i don't know that she knows but i but i'm like yep. i feel like the obligation of like oh dang it i should have like made it clear to her that i was like do had to do something else and yep yeah yep it's so you're like crap now it looks suspicious but uh, your palladium sister takes out his phone it. sends a text oh. and immediately ping uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah no i i, I don't think i think it looks suspicious i that's not that right. wouldn't be palladium's first instinct right. it would just be oh, okay. like oh i let down my sister right like yeah. she and, wanted and that she was, really uh, wanted um, to go to the tournament with me and yeah. i let her down right uh, and that was the obligation you chose to ignore exactly so. Uh, okay, so let's uh, right. wrap up there. And uh, so, like, phase two is going to be the um, the oddball one, mm-hmm. where right, yeah. uh, and and uh, uh, I guess uh, since you guys read the thing, uh, the top four players start. So there's going to be five oddballs total. There's nine teams, uh, four people each, and um, okay. the the top four players start with one of the oddballs, and the other eight teams have to fight over the other four. Mm-hmm. Um, you guys will all start in like your own locations with like the oddballs in the middle. In preparation for like this game, since the flag, we had it, but like keep it away or as well. Yeah, in preparation for this game, since we knew before time, I brought a kickball with me. Uh, I think that would be illegal. What? <laughs> that would be against the tournament. Other people get to so, bring like, equipment. Uh, well, you did bring <laughs> yeah, yeah. equipment. No, it, so so you his, would have had to check that in. Is it, that, yes, is that no, exactly. In his. Ball? If yeah. you let me, I, I would in try. His new, in his in his like new costume change, he's like, I want to like be known as the kickball hero. So <laughs> <laughs> look, yeah, don't hate on my don't part hate of my prop. Uh, right. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I'll 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 let you do it, but it's gonna look really suspicious, bro. Um, I am okay with looking as bad as possible. Okay, I do not all right. care. Yeah. All right. That, that's <laughs> have you okay. met left wing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yep. Left all wings. Right. I uh, the kind of hero left wing wants to be is the kind of hero that wins. Yeah. Uh, yep. So. <laughs> yep. Uh, <laughs> all right so we'll uh uh pick this nice. up next time we play but uh Sounds good. start with phase two it's been heroes in training thanks for playing guys adios yeah